Mike's testicles. Okay. We're looking good, man. Uh. And to get hot, I got Lana, I got hair and legs that turn, that, 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 that turn uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun. So you get nothing, you lose. And to get hot, I got Lana. I got hairy legs that turn that 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 that, that, that turn uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun. And to get hot, I got so Lana. I got hairy legs nothing. that turn that 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 Good that, day, that, that turn uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun. Wagwizzy, 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 yo. Welcome to Jurassic Park, Nevada. We have cleared out a lovely section of the desert and we are going to measure up. Now, we're going to measure up. So, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I wasn't, was I going to measure up? I was going to measure up, but I wasn't at the same time, you know? Um, This is a little bit orcs. It's a little bit orcs. It can be a little bit awkward measuring up when you've got 
you see you have to use i find easiest way is to use large power stations and hit the edge of the maps you know figure out the true edge this is what it is it's got to be as close to either border but they don't differentiate I ain't got the patience today. That's too finicky. I ain't got the patience for that. Not today. Um, boom. So there goes Power Station 1. Let's have a look at Power Station 2. Uh, boom, 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 boom. Do, 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 do. Right? So power station two would be like this, you know. It's another bit. Quale, 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 k k k k k k. So there we go. Let's get right out. Ah, two more to go. Edges of the Nevada map are dodgy, I can't lie. <clears throat> We've never been here. This is new content for me. It's supposed to be Nevada, but it looks very snowy, right? I don't know. I don't know. You know, I don't know. I don't fucking know, man. Maybe. That will do. So, why I've done that is to measure the road as you see. What you need, what I need, is to find the center point of my map, which in strategy games in 2023 should just literally be a, a button of a mathematical grid that just says a1 do you know what i mean and i could designate a, a square as you know grid zero and then start working from there so we get to see if the map is square i don't think the map is square i feel like it was longer than it was wide Although we do not know, that is not a theory that is proven to be true right now. We have a whole thing. We have a whole thing. That was crazy. Okay, so 
it's a whole thing going on there. And you see what it is? I don't even need the buildings. I don't need the buildings and I don't need the road. The road isn't part of the design. The building isn't, isn't, isn't part of the design. The crossroad might not even be a part of my design. I'm thinking I just want to get in there. Do you know what I mean? I just want to get in there somewhere near the middle. Nothing, nothing microscopically accurate. You know, I'm not even trying to be that accurate. I'm just trying to find the general center. You know, which we'll know as I do this. There you go. Center line achieved. So that crossroad there is where, you know, the, the, the X is. It marks the spot and we're going to see what comes to mind. I don't know. I'm going to think about creation before I create because... You know, there's a lot of things to do. I do want to be comprehensive like normal. I just want to know the rough design of what I'm thinking. Little minor, the de fractional degree of off skew. So that's not a problem though. Yeah, we've got the cross. So... This was yesterday's park design. We don't know what way we're facing. How do we figure out what way we're even facing? Is there a northeast, southwest? I can't see it. If there is a northeast, southwest, I can't see it in this game. I don't know where the fuck it is. How would you tell? Where's the sun? What's the settings? So we've got a day and night cycle happening every 15 minutes. Well, the sun rises in the east and sets in the west, so we'll know which direction is the east. Um, it may be. It may be fundamental to my design in the first place. Who knows? Some interesting buildings. I got some new dinosaurs. I don't know about doing the multiple, uh, uh, the the super enclosures. So I was thinking of the ops deck at the center, right? This right here is a crazy arrival building. Look at that. Look at that. That shit's sick, right? I don't know what to do with this bit. I even know what to do with this piece. <coughs> Look at it. It's fucking gorgeous. So we could align it. I see. I didn't realize it would align like that. Okay. Yo, the sun's coming up. Ah, oh, shit. Does that mean that the east? Is that the east over there? Fuck, how would we even know? If you can't look up in the sky and see the sun. Yo, can I just look up? No sun. Okay. Fair enough. Can I look up if I'm, like, on the floor? Yes, I can. But there is no sun today. That's all it is. I feel like it's behind those clouds that would make it east over there. East over there, which would be like, I don't even know how we could even tell. So if it's east over there, which I believe is where I was looking, then east would be, and then those would be southern mountains. Southern mountains. So those mountains are south. 
from me. Let's have a look. Um, all that vegetation shit is crazy. I don't know why it does that shit, to be honest. Graphically, I should have a look, innit? It shouldn't be no high shade of quality. Texture quality, I don't like either, you know. Oh, no, no, low. I can't lie. I hope that that gives us a little bit more. You know, it doesn't really change what's happening with the textures, but that, that, that's nothing. It just pisses me off just to look at it. Um, no problems though. So, what to build? How to build it? I did not see the Colosseum. Ah, it's there. So, I do want one of them. I got some new shit. I got some new shit. I wanted some. Uh, this. This building has it all. This building has a lot inside it. It has everything. don't think there's a lot of buildings that you need after you put it down so i want to find that out but i want to also put the choppers together if i'm putting choppers down i want to put choppers together so that everything's in a similar place um this is what i wanted to do last time as well so <sighs> she where's the east that's the south so we could We could bring it in on this mad thing here. That's a crazy line, right? But it would roughly work. I swear down it would work. What it is, is these southern mountains behind us. Okay, so now looking at it, I don't know if I want to build this building, but like, I do want to build this building, but I don't know if it's at the center where I want it like this. Oh, you're fucking me up. You're fucking me up. Can't do it like that. I don't know if I'm going to do it like that. I think I might just do it like this. Instead of make it a little bit easier to work with. You know, one thing I like to do sometimes is to change the texture of both roads. So one becomes... Just luxury path. And the other one becomes... Fuck it, that would do. And the other one becomes classic path. So I could tell which one is being occluded when I'm doing that. It don't much matter. Connect it up. Storm incoming. It's always a fucking storm in this place. This building looks ancient and shit, right? But this is an all-inclusive building, if I remember. If I'm using my head right. So 
you could use an arrival point, but this is an arrival point. So we could use another one. Okay, interesting. Is there a chopper on this? There's a chopper pad on that. That would be a funny old building to have. I'm not going to have a fossil center. I don't think we needed a fossil center. Didn't think we needed an exp expedition center either. Or a staff center. What the fuck? And is this building power in itself? Seems to be power in itself. I've already had one of these... Um, things up and running with regards to the uh, the usage I was doing experiments and I found um, no matter what that's going to touch the inside right so don't worry about it then just build it where you like um, yeah I was using I was using that building to round up some dinosaurs Off the market five minutes ago. That will do. Wait. How are you powered? How were you plumbed in? Yo, there's a chopper there as well. This is what I'm saying. Oh, that's a little space for a whip. Oh, because this is a response facility, of course. Man, you're fucking gay. You didn't even clock that. Um, right, keep with the ops. Keep with the ops right now. So we don't need a control center. You see this? We don't need control center or, visit or visitor centers, right? Now, we might have a paleo facility with another one of those arrival buildings because that arrival building is kind of sick. Yeah, and they're coming now onto the fairway there so this would put the helipad in the right position and hope that the last one has got my back hey man I'm feeling the theme choppers in the middle alright let's get more so that was arrival point two why do we need a science center? I don't know. Oh, it's the it's this. It's this. You wouldn't use the expedition center, which has got what I was going to go to, or the staff center. I've got the response facility. I need a paleo, but we'll deal with that. It is potentially this acquisition center thing here gets rid of the need for everything. There is somehow a helipad in the right place when I do that. Now this could be it. As far as the one that I want. This could be it. Wait there. How did this building fit onto the grid? Randomly like that, yeah. Well, that's random. Um, now the ops. It's, it is this building. This building is the king. I wouldn't mind doing it like that. In a way. But I do think they might need to swap. But I don't think that does anything if they do. Because then I could bring this in here like this. That would fit better. But with this. I think it could you know. Put that there a sec. When I need to know all the shortcuts for this game. I don't know the shortcuts. 
right now, which is a shame. That's fine. And this is how this is going to go then. gap is almost nothing, isn't it? Get it to you see that dot. That will do. So we're choppers coming going. Now if we check ops. Okay, pretty sure that we don't need an expedition center. Pretty sure that I don't need a staff center. I don't know why they're showing me. Because the arrival points are locked off, the control centers, the visitor centers, the science centers, the fossil center is locked off. Okay. Okay, so maybe we do need these things. We definitely need paleo. Which could be fun. That's a response one. This is the paleo one. Oh, shit. That's fine for me. So this is a facility where you can take injured dinosaurs. <clears throat> Everything at the center of the park, I don't know why. Just yet. Dun 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 So dipping in, we're going to see that we don't need paleo. We did that. Won't need response. We did that. I'm sure that I don't need a staff center, bruv.
bricks in the book bag go in the fair zone. Sure, they need that building, you know. Just letting me build another one and another one and another one. Okay, 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 okay. I'm sure, I didn't need it though. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm thinking. I didn't actually need it. might delete it just for this just in case yeah because this building looks sick Bear choppers about. I like that. I'm actually done with ops. That's pretty cool. It's pretty fucking cool. So now. This is the thing. If you're arriving here. You know. My tendency would be. To, and this is all we need. Right. My tendency would be. To actually just wall them in. Although I know that I need more. There's so much more to come, you know. There is a lot more to come. But these. These are all the park utilities. Like I could upgrade them now. Like look. That's nuts. Additional Ranger team with the task schedule in there.
improved yield with the extra capacity I like that Serving as a fossil center, okay. I'll just have the faster transit because I'm not too sure what I actually even get from that faster transitness. All right. don't really need that but I'll take it anyway and then when we turn the settings up it will come into effect much later in the game so we're two that way two that way I would like to go two that way what do we have in terms of what does he got operations but operations ain't doing it for me anymore I'm thinking like we, we might need another response facility probably do but there's too many choppers already now I'm done with the choppers I'm kind of done with the staff centers. There's no need for a staff center if this is what's going on. Let me have a plop down and actually have a quick look at the upgrades. You can take scientist capacity. Specialist traits, okay. I mean, I guess. You know, them ones, they're best. Not really. <coughs> that ain't really it, is it? In terms of the ops. And that's fine. Enclosure-wise, don't need anything popping just yet. Fine. Attraction-wise, again, don't need anything popping unless we're going to build little entrances to the rest of the park, which ain't really the one again it's not really the one actually although things like guest attractions an innovation center is key do you know what i mean and where does it go in this on this lineup where the fuck does that go i don't know might put it at the end of something jimmy you know mean? we got hotels i might just bang it and bang five hotels coming off of it you know land it and bang five hotels coming off of it or have five monorails going elsewhere. I don't even know yet what we would do, but it should have, could have been the center of the park. You know, the ones that da -na -na -na, with shit coming off of it, breaking down the park into what the three, what the three, six slices, which would have been dope as fuck, actually. Could still be sort of done. I do like this little helicopter middle bit. This is crazy. Especially, look, when it gets covered in snow, the shit looks dope. You know what I mean? That actually does. It looks dope when it's covered in snow. We've got helicopters fucking everywhere. We've got industry hanging off of the side. This could be a good park idea for like a pizza slice park, you know? Six, six different sections. 
or we could use that to do the very same idea but with more of a more of a vision so in the, like in the middle bang same as we was thinking we could wall it off we've got invisible wall I think this might actually be my new plan, yo. Is just to face this somewhere back to the southern mountains. It would be the back. You couldn't really do it back to the southern mountains, but you could there. Oh, I have done that already. Okay, so then, I mean, I like it. I like it. I like it. You know what, though? Gonna have to save this one and call it fucking something else. Just, this is, this is, <coughs> this is JPN. We're going to overwrite it. But I don't want a new save fucking with that. So we're going to call this new save, like, I don't know, the mountain or something, you know. Joke, man, man, I just trolling. I get on board of that. I need more than that. I'm on mine. I don't even watch your thing. Run. Right. So we got a new Tigolo. This is all great and that. But hear what me saying now. So from there, yeah, 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 and all of that. Now at the middle, yeah, 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 all of that. Okay, so it needs to be like. All right. So that's one section. No idea what's going on in the middle there. There's another section, another section. This seems to make it equalish. That's making it unequal. That's the direction we're facing anyway. Building's gonna be wider than that. Drop that little bit off. Gonna need these bottom bits actually. Gonna really need them, so. Let's just see what fits. So that's the southern mountain over there. And what was I thinking? It's an attraction. You focus it around the attraction. So we're visually trying to get it into the center. Which is if we just add a little head onto that road there, go back, have a little look at what we're doing. Because I'm having ideas with regards to how I might even <clears throat> connect this thing. So I want it very approximately in the center. And what is the middle of this building now? I mean, it's kind of like So I don't know if it's exactly that, but Let's just imagine, right, we put it on as close as it went there. How would that, yeah. So that feels off by the head. That feels off by the head. We 
which is interesting because we need that head take off that take off that and that and then I'm gonna add so it had about that and then I'm gonna want to put a little bit more on like that now moving the thing with the appropriate accuracy shouldn't be hard we just attach it as close as it gets and be, just be as accurate as one can be Me and my boys still bang, and we're clapping up, no thanks, finally rich. Ah, so. There was a key line, which are these lines. Which are going to just get the nod from me. just to see if the connector works kind of does right fucking no deviation zero deviation what we don't need then is the corners Resilient bit of road. Didn't want to go. See the fourth street, my domain, savage. Yeah. For every fucking body get robbed. hate it when tunes fly through my head because it's like you know you might as well go listen this was perfect road I didn't need to get rid of it it was just the other corner idiot <clears throat> however it's likely that I don't need the massive power stations we got hyperloop right Hyperloop power stations, which are connected underground as opposed to be connected on the top. So we won't even really need the corners like that either. I'll delete all of them. Delete a bit of this road. Do you know what? I'm going to delete all of the road because we're going to command how many sections will go out and then straight spider web it. You know them ones there? Straight spider web, spider web. So, do, 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 do. so we could probably kill that. Just gonna kill that for the sake of it, and uh, now back in into my almost invisible desert pyramid, cylindrical desert pyramid. Now there's a choice here. You could also use main fruit, or you could use luxury main fruit. But I'm feeling like, so this would be the main fruit. And 
man. This would be the luxury main. <laughs> this is no fucking difference. Fuck that. All right, cool. Replacing is off. So now. Et voilà. <laughs> So there is need for a gyro station. There is need for we have one, two, three, four, five, six connectors here. Yeah. There is need of gyro. There is need of <coughs> mono. There is need of Jeep. Let's say we doubled up the mono. Say we doubled up the Jeep then. And then we'd have to double up the gyro. So two gyros, two monos, two things. Is that really what's good? Could work. Could work. And I feel like I want to make those something part of the feature. But I wouldn't want to do it too belligerently. Like imagine, for instance, yeah, we just took this extender right here. Boom. Gave it a massive, massive strip. Yeah. And just one, just for example sake. And then we took <coughs> and we put the Jeeps on. You understand? So it would sort of end in a Jeep run. Oh, shit. Ah, yeah. So the angles are very specific. Okay. Okay. So the angles are very specific. I remember. So we don't think about that point of it yet then because the angles are too specific. What we need to think about is enclosure, is habitat. How we're going to make everything fit and feel in the pizza slices. How it, how it details approaching the building because wouldn't it be cool if you're walking around the path the path which we haven't built yet actually because we could make superior interconnections here via which you don't have to go through the visitor center do you know what I mean you could skip the visitor center right now it looks good because we're going right up to it but we could you see there There is a hook somewhere. And I may just connect the hooks. I won't be able to trust the hooks like that. That's shameful. What an idiot. You literally just did this. I won't be able to trust the hooks measurements if I'm just guesstimating them like that. But I could just make the hooks now. Obviously make the hooks now. Makes better sense. One hook. Whoa, something went wrong with that one. Something went deeply wrong with that one.
So now people can walk around the entire building, right? doesn't work but that works can you get the same shape um broski oh what the fuck say word you ain't even put the hooks on over there you're an idiot possible Right. Oh, for fuck's sake. Same shape. Let's go. Easy. Beautiful. So. Oh, and now the guesstimation of the naturals. Fuck that. Those was easy. Those can come naturally. These now. Fuck, you know. And again, I should do it. You know what I mean? Create hooks and then create another another box by which they can, do you know what I mean? A section via which stuff can, you know? Because I think I will. I could do that with one. So like, imagine... The hook was there, and the hook was there, yeah? If I tried to clip them, it's close that they don't actually work, look. Yeah, look, too bendy. Too bendy, for me anyway. Hmm. I will just keep the slices. This would be the only defensive, uh, the only lateral line. Maybe some out there. Do you know what I mean? But after a few. So this is two. No, this is one. That would be two. That would be three. Four and five. One, two, three, four,
just approximating that road there. Looks short, doesn't it? So does that, but that's fine. And now, if they would connect, they would connect. And how to do that? No idea. No idea. Maybe just send a road off in that direction until it connects. Do you know what I mean? Is there a lot of map left? There's quite a lot of map left, so you probably could like just send for instance i'll show you what i mean so where are we starting we're starting like that so those two sections need to meet and these two sections need to meet so this could be like you know just grab the hook right i uh, see how so that would be the most lateral okay we could just line up hooks <clears throat> it's no problem look if you put a massive hook on the end of everything now then we connect up them hooks by using the linear nature of them if you know what I'm saying the fact that they're along a line even though they're offline that is like setting its own line isn't it right so you need to just know what rough shape you want when you look at the hooks collectively like that get that wrong any one of these lines wrong and the shape doesn't work so um why does this feel so big it's because it is one two three four five one, two, three, four, five, six. And what did I make the mistake over anywhere else? This side did it as well. Symmetrically, this side did it. That was crazy. And here. I don't think you can change the convergence point, can you?
forgot I had to build this corner again. Right, it's the fucking about all this one building. Right, but a very nice design. So, <clears throat> within this design, we're going to be doing a few things. I think. We need to figure out everything. Where does everything go? These are the basic roads. But how do people get here? Now you could spawn in front of this center here, right? With the maddest view. <coughs> Looking into the mountains. Do you know what I mean? <coughs> I think it would be cool. And it would be like a good one. Do you know what I mean? Like you come from here, look. How does it line up? It lines up. It's beautiful. So we could look have you lining up like this. <coughs> you understand? And we would just detour the road. Oops. It's this way, isn't it? Yeah. And we would just detour the road into it and then around it. Do you know what I mean? So you're literally spawning as close as you could spawn. And then the pathing would be... It would be something like that. And then the pathing would just go around it. Now I do, I want you to come in and see but like if you're too close then you don't really see if you come from a bit further back then you get to see so we could have you on the outside i can't lie it could even be that you're on the outside looking in crazy like this right and that would mean that i could That would mean that that is the exact frame for this. And the pathing could probably be sorted out relatively easy. I've never done it like this before, but there's one dot. Whoops. Let's find another one. 
There's another one, and we are running on diesel, man. So you come out of there, you see the center in the distance. It's a random place to come out in the park, but we're good. It's going to lead to people actually turning up while we're co constructing the place. That's no problem. <clears throat> It's no problem. So I would immediately, as soon as you come, I would immediately want some destinations, right? This could be transport road. Who knows? I don't think so. But it could be something similar. Like, you know where you want the monorail working? Wait, there. Just what exactly was that? I know I've seen you. So it's how would these be set up is the question. They would be all over. I like the idea of back to backs. I want I want back to backs. I can hear the cat trying to get in the studio. Now that we found love, what are we gonna do? We did. I did want a complicated monorail system, but one that is just like simple in its own right. Cat's trying to get in the studio. Let me let him in. Trying to lure me out, you know. Sitting out there talking about meow. 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 So, I mean, yeah. And no. Imagine the... When you do stupidness like that, that you get frustrated, don't you? So we know how much it's supposed to be. It's what you've got to pay attention to, and this is everything. I don't even know if this will work. It's just an experiment, but I want to see. do for me and once again imagine a duplicate that couldn't go right there because of that
<clears throat> oh shit. Yeah, too close. No, like a double station, but I was trying to, like, there's going to need to be a little bit more of a gap. Quite a fair bit more of a gap. There is an idea for, there's a shout for rotation, maybe. It isn't exactly what I was looking. So that's a maybe at some point. <clears throat> this is where we're going with it. It's going to be like this. There is going to be a monorail station. It's a real big shame that you can't mirror the buildings. Do you know what I mean? So that I didn't have to, like, you know, play all the silly, silly buggers. Immediately one leg doesn't go down and that's a good thing because it would have blocked the road now the idea for this one <coughs> is to back to back it Jeez, you understand? Telling me things and humble me down. Lose the leg again, beautiful. Crazy. Crazy. And then with exact, with exact building, you know, on the monorail scheme, we're not going to do that. Uh, and that is going to be too much. Therefore, we're not going to do that. That will be too much. So, we do need 
to come away from the facility. That's a necessity. That's a necessity. And then working back around, we'll still need one more. At least. And is there a default curve that we could have? I swear there's a default curve. There wasn't. But. That might be enough to do some shit. I mean, you'd have to come away first. You have to come away first. So you'd have to do that angle there. Then that angle there. And then you can come around. And now when you come back. What is it it's supposed to be? That angle, that angle, then that, then that, which won't work for that because they will cross, which could be sick, but it doesn't allow it to just like a light, a light, a light elevation. Do you know what I mean? If you could just add light elevation, there it is. There's the overlap mechanic. Which would enable me to just get, you know, in under. Right, so there'd be more to it, though. Because... Can the rail run, by the way... Why am I getting the right angle? There you go. Right angle. Can the, can the rail run over the thing? No matter how hard reality seems. So, all you're going to have to do is make this loop bigger. Go wider. Right? Therefore, that one was wrong. This only needed to be the righty. So is this thicker? It is a thicker angle, look. You see? So now, even if you come through one, you'll be able to go through the other. No, you won't. It might need to be just wider, but... Oh, for fuck's sake. I would imagine that you want something like that. And we could get some custom angles in there in a minute. Jeez. So it literally needs that curve already. Would it be that? That's unplayable. <clears throat> Might be. Huh. Huh. 
Huh. Thinking, where am I going? That was close. That being the bigger angle would mean that we could have and we had the opportunity to follow it in and half it out. No, no, no. we would need to add the curve wow that's such a perfect line reason being because it's going to be symmetrical and I know I know for a fact that I can work with that let me recreate that in symmetry this could just do the job at this point it could already do the job but I do want something a little fancier maybe I'm trying to do that could that be done that's two pieces only needs to be one because this could just This could just do whatever curve immediately. So I mean, that could do that curve for all we give a shit. Do you know what I mean? Just come out of the station and get gone that way. <clears throat> and then this can maybe do what it does but without this section now. <laughs> Drama. And I remember it off by heart. So it's not gonna, and I don't know why we needed all the length of curve. If we just take the one piece, start the curve straight away, keep it mild, keep it mild strong strong mild and we're back running on diesel but just one segment because we still don't know how to symmetricalize give it the space like that so light curve 90 90 180 180 90 boom can't do anything dramatic like that blam like them two harsh curves because they don't actually bring you into that right spot joking
to have no degree by which to measure this. I do, there it is. Could there be a monorail crash with that? This can't go on and do its thing along that line. So it might have to be across the other line, which could indeed just be another experiment here. Wasn't the, oh shit, is that not symmetrical? Oh, is that what that's doing this time? It's coming right back on itself. That is nice. I mean, what then if I give it one section here? Is that too much, in it? Because then it can't do the light curve there. Has to do the heavy curve. Can't do another. So that's bollocks. So then it goes straight in from heavy curve into light curve and it's just back into itself now. Another light curve takes us out off track. A minimum piece gets us on. So this maximum piece here, what does this do? So the maximum piece is pop. We'll stick with the minimum piece. And then that will involve maybe two minimum pieces. Maybe even three. Which we can't work with. We can't follow that curve, can we? Fuck. Shouldn't we be able to follow that curve? Isn't that a... Isn't that a light curve that starts here? Let's have a look and see. Am I stupid? Isn't that a light curve? Can't we get out of there? How does that light curve take me so deep around this... Oh, because it's going around the short curve. It's not coming in. That is incredible, because look at that. That would be really nice. Just to come follow the curve and then get out. Come out equilaterally. Anyway. So we've got second minimum piece here. Which doesn't feel like... Difference in angle, maybe. Don't tell you the degrees. So I'm thinking. So that's not viable, which is crazy. How do we get a viable line? Might have to just bring one from the north. Do you know the ones that bring something from the north? just to actually connect up a viable line here. Do you know what I mean? 
like if you was to bend around like that you would create the viable line right and then we could go down like that and just connect the two however they connect because th this has got to be backwards engineered look best you could do and then obviously those would connect quite simply yeah so the way you get your symmetry damn perfect and then you ain't need those off the rules sorry pal cheese oh my oh my so we have our monorail system which will provide a minor like we'll put something here like a lagoon or something like what would go here we'd have to put like a little enclosure here like a breeding enclosure off to the south boom 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 massive breeding enclosure or coliseum even and then you watch from the monorail as you go past the coliseum right because i wasn't even intending on bringing this this building right but you could you could factor it into this somehow <laughs> It doesn't fit in the middle, which we wouldn't expect it to anyway, but it's actually like completely obstructed by the monorail. So wow, what is it? But some of that will just build into it. And you just get to see it for a second as you go past. Just you see it all. I see the breeding line. There will be a way to make that symmetrical, I believe, if. Not like symmetrical, but in a nice, accurate position. I don't want to guesstimate it. It looks like it would make a decent guesstimation. I don't know what I should put in this gap just yet. I do want to focus, not focus, but I do want to get the monorail looking a little bit more tandem. I think that, as I suspected, you wouldn't need to come out of the station with a curve. You could do that somewhere else. <clears throat> it's a pretty cool idea, but like you wouldn't need to come out with the curve if you're going to do the hard curve anyway. And that looks a little bit more, yeah. And then we can go around or we can do the lighty. It depends. It depends. Because what, what's happening with any of this? All right, so it actually has a line, which is perfect. Already got that double monorail going down to the dun 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 So you can't get away with a light eat. you're not gonna get away with much. I 
do think we're monorailing though. We're literally we're monorailing now. So I want to come out of the station on a on a whoa whoa. Then I maybe want to come around in a curve. I don't know. Like you could come out of this station with a curve. Maybe it's just a light curve though. At the moment, we're coming out of the station into light curve. And this <coughs> could it go light curve to light curve? I don't know where it's actually going. It might fuck off over there. And the same thing over here, like just light curve off to the east. So what is it? It comes out normal and then it hits. Wait, what? You're right, right. Hits. Heavy curve into light curve. Bosh. Looking pretty awesome in terms of where they're going to go. The visualization here. I want them to see something. I want them to see, you know, breeding or something happening here. It will be really cool. Let's get that popping. I'm going to get it popping. I'm going to find a way to do it because we've got invisible walls. So I want to see invisible walls. I, I want to see them working. You know what I mean? I want to see them working. Right? Just a confirmation. You can't go over this building, right? So it's going to need minimum of light curve. I do think light curve be appropriate because of where we might potentially be going because look a double light curve just takes me around the system now I could just keep going with these lighties back to my original course I'm just eccentric that's why I'm doing that fuck it Was that accurate? Jeez. I want to see that monorail just working. That's going to be dope as fuck. <clears throat> monorail visibility is high as shit here. This could just go around the edge. Do you know what I mean? This is what that's going to do. It's just going to go all the way around like the edge and shit. I'm going to start doing broad curves. Can't you do that?
there's a there's a sweet spot where it snaps and uh yeah that's what you see me trying to find when i'm when i'm tentatively making micro adjustments like a fucking prick Supposed to be Nevada, but I keep getting, keep getting a. Uh, <clears throat> storms, you know, um, not storms, but like snow. Yeah, no, it snow so much in Nevada. So it was hot for large portions of the year. Okay, double dipping out there on that thing. There's a lot of enclosures going to be down there in the south. A lot of enclosures going to be down there in the south. There's going to be interior loop happening, which becomes an exterior loop into the interior loop. These guys are all point in the same direction, so there's literally the possibility for... See, the monorail is not going to be useful up here. So I'm thinking to just loop it around the edge, you know, and then cut back in, wiggle back in. Simple as that, right? So it would be, it'd be maybe one more piece. Then a light curve if we could ever find the gun. Like I said, there's not going to be a lot to see. So. Big curve. Big piece. Light curve out. Thinking massive curve back. Now, if we could get the 90 out of a big curve here. Without interaction, I'll just slap that back with a mild S. So there you go. All right, cool. So that was. Whoops. I should let you off down there, and I might. I may just. I may just let you off down there, like once. On one station, each line up there, because there's only two stations needed up there. This one interior loop station might have something on the outer edges, but I doubt it. And then, because it's literally just a zub, 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 back in, you know, the ones there. That would be like the south. Wait, we are looking south. So that would be the north east. This is the north east line. Let's actually mark them for what they are. This monorail station would be the north east and then the 
station here would be going southeast. So, and then this would be southwest, and then this would be you get nothing. Fair enough, North Wheezy. So the lines are drawn out. <laughs> And there's one circle in production, so the monorail might actually start. I don't want it to start, though. Ah, oh, thank fuck. They're not pathed in. Because there's already guests here. I don't want a guest to start using them unless I path it in exactly at that moment. And I'm going to. I'm going to actually path that in perfectly at the same moment. So potentially, the monorails leave at the same time and they go side by side around the park. That would be really cool. So, we had, boom, a minimum into a light curve, into a maximum, into a huge light curve, is it? It can be hard to find these. There, there's, there, 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 there. Reference. All right, so this huge light curve then goes into a maximum. Then it goes into... A light, a light curve into a huge, into a maximum U. Found it, and then that goes into a maximum straight at the corner, which turns into a big light. And then we can get a little S. Mild S. Jeez. Right. So the northwest and the northeast lines are done. Let's do the southern lines because they don't take much, to be honest. I'm just going to. Uh, and I could always just edit it anytime that I like. Do you know what I mean? So let's get us going into like a. Maybe a max. A max light. So I felt it around there somewhere. There it is. Uh, max light into a minimum light into a max straight into. Oh, yeah, two big lights that'll do. Two massive lights, then we're going to need a minimum, a minimum, and then join them with the S. Why not? Pretty cool line. How did that work again now? So we come out of the station with a max curve, with a light curve, big one. Which I can never seem to get unless I'm looking down on. found you you little cunt so uh, that max curve turns into what a little curve into a max piece into a double double 90 
which is going to be so much bigger than the normal Yui can't even find the cunt found him there you are you little bastard so now let's get another equally nearly found it forced that well done uh, that goes from uh, ah, double curve into complete U into complete U into mild S <coughs> beautiful <laughs> just a, a monorail in the desert nothing nothing mad about that alright let's pause it right this is going to be the trick to getting them all activated simultaneously yeah for a start I don't know if there's anything to tell them clockwise alright look, look, look let's path it first let's path it first because it might be something to do with the pathing get the dot on that one get the dot on that one now these ones are they're not tricky but how do you want to path them directly in just plumb them in here right oh you could go what from there directly into 90 into a dot that's cool that's cool all right cool we'll do that then you go from there apparently you go directly into a locked up 90 into dot that's beautiful so once they go online they're ready now problem is is there anything to edit about it there's nothing to edit about it now one more time check so they run automated but there are guests in the park already. Yeah. So we're going to see monorails moving. And I just don't know what direction that they're going to go. So we're going to see. I'm hoping that we see monorails moving. Give people the chance to use them. There's nothing to see on them yet. So who knows. But I think they just automate anyway. But the transport links. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Is it down to the way that I pathed it? definitely pulled these out of here but or is it down to the way that they're facing so you left out that way and so did you right no you left out that way sorry wait there you left out that way the outer one inner one and yeah you guys are facing it's about the way that the station is facing okay okay that's fine that's fine no one's really gonna cross each other but we got maximum maximum root coverage though Maximum root coverage. That's beautiful. Mwah. They should get more monorails on the thing, though. More monorails on the on the track. So you, 
you can actually put them in in situ like that now you see I didn't know that I didn't know that because I would probably put them up here but look how they drag the track up that's mad how they drag the track up you know <coughs> I can't lie that is crazy how they dragging the track up bit look just warping it even on a big fat straight that I've put them on you know what I mean even on a massive straight they're still dragging up the track thing is they are not symmetrical so getting on and getting off of one line is going to be a drama if I don't I want to do like two next to each other like that boom and then boom like so that there would be bang oops and then you know equivalently not not the way that they are do you know what I mean? So they'd be like that. But then they'd be leaving out of the same direction. Which would be crazy. And I don't know how that doesn't affect the direction putting putting new links in there. I don't know how that doesn't affect the direction. Do you know what I mean? Because I could just put stations here like this then. As if they would allow it. God damn it. But I'm going to have to kill that outside line anyway. That outside link there anyway. So it would be fine. But I would need to know exactly where to measure that. So where would the monorails go on the outside? I just want stations up here. That's all. Just so that people can stop off. You know. I think what that requires is. To break down these straights. And insert station. And then. Now, I don't know how could we affect the the, the, the the monorail direction with this with this modification. We could potentially affect the monorail direction like this. I don't know, though. I don't know how to affect the monorail direction if because like that would be on that line. So, like, let's say, which man then went which way? Yeah, so you actually going that way. So he'd be coming, at the, 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 and his station, his stairs are on the right-hand side, yeah? And that's what way they're all traveling, stairs to the right. So, da, 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 So, if I put, wait there, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. His stairs are on his right. So as he comes around this way, the stairs would be facing the road. Which is exactly what I might not do. With this guy then. Stairs would be facing away. Now, to check the directionality of this line. So I figure that this line would be coming from the opposite direction. Wait, what? Where is he? I can't even see him right now. Is it too cold for the monorail? It's too cold for the monorail. Shit. So, stairs on... As you look at the stairs, my man will be going south, I believe. So, that would make him coming all the way out and then going all the way up through the mid. And still going out and he's going this way. And to reverse his flow... Pause. Wait there. His stairs are on his right. So he's coming out the same way. 
Yeah, and they go in opposite directions as they go in here. So that would be the same way. So his stairs on his right. So if I put the stairs on the left there. And that is just the possibility. So, right. I've figured out this one. Yeah. I think I've figured out that one. So if we've got per se, his stairs are on his right. His stairs are on his oops. And he's coming around this way. So I really want his stairs. Oops. See, that would be coursing him in the same direction this would be to reverse the direction on his side that would be to reverse the direction on his side yeah per se not sure where that goes I think that's a little bit steep, right? Let's just imagine it for a second from above. Quick experimentation. So if that was there, then this couldn't join because the curve's too sharp. That couldn't join because the curve's too sharp. And that's fine. We could just move it up a little bit. Um, but that would be where that goes now. Going back again. My man is coming around on the right. So that is to keep him going in the same direction. Which may work for me on in this guy's case. And per se... That is a curve too sharp, and that is a curve too sharp, which is more of a problem for him. More of a problem for him. You know, more of a problem for him. That works, but this don't. Because of the structure of the track. Now could you make it work? Not without deleting time. On the run and eventually they would desync. So there wouldn't even be no point. Because I'd like them both to be coming up here at the same time. But I don't mind that they don't do that. To be honest. Because they provide a moment of. And the other lines are not doing it either. And I'm not going to make the other lines do it. Either. Because they have. Where would they want to get off? Like they've got that. And where would they want to even get off? Maybe maybe somewhere out here. Do you know what I mean? Put a station on each side. One station over here. One station over there. Potentially. I'm not going to interfere with my big curve. Maybe I'll put one. Like but it would have to be. Fucking miles away. To even make it worth it. I don't, I don't even think it's. It's even worth it with that one. That that ride is pretty short, but this one's long. So, here's the thing, though. Do you seek to disturb the direction of both of them? They're both moving in the correct direction. So, I think this building just gets... Do -do 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 done like that. And we do some, symmetrically sh some symmetrical shit. You know, and instead of trying to bum 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 but it just definitely doesn't work like that, does it? Yeah, because you gotta go way too far back. So that ain't a problem, that ain't a problem, that ain't a problem. I'm gonna work that out. And now what I wanna do is kinda just
get the right angle to see that in line, you know. Girlies, rub on your titties. Yeah, I said it, rub on your titties. New York City, pretty committed, pity the fool that. Right, hold on. Right. Y'all know the name. Farrah fucking Mon Jane, a damn thing change. Some might even say this song is sexist because I asked the girls to rip on the breasts. Oh. That is because of a slight, the slightest deviation, isn't it? The, s the m most molecular deviation is just look. One direction gets reversed, one direction does not.
I'm expecting the north east and the north and the northwest lines to come out of this station in this direction, both of them. Two stations, two trains figured it out. That's beautiful. And then the other two are going to go. Bzz. And there they go. And that's beautiful because they're all sort of around each other. Look at this now. Oh man, that's exactly what I wanted. Dun, 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 Jays. Yo, that's banging. All right, lad, that's fucking banging. That's fucking banging. So, um, yeah. I don't know how we're going to connect those, but we're going to connect those. I'm steady trying to cop those colossal size Picassos. All right. Maybe just connect it in both ways like a G. Look, just make the ting with the hooks and use them. Jamin. train goes into the station chills there for a while that's beautiful all right let's pause the game for a sec while we're at this point so your hooks will be going into a round bit yours is not i see but it's possible that yours might not have to let's can we get a natural 90 can I get a dot of that? Because we can get a line. Don't know if I'm getting dot though. I mean, I don't even mind that minor deviation there. What is such a fuck up with this? All right, cool. So you too could have given me the natural 90. And I think I might just, I don't know. That might be what we do, to be honest, because it serves a much better line, doesn't it? So if I give this another minimum jink, then over there, that that might be viable. And it is, it just knocks down the pole, look. Simple. So forget the outer connector. Give me another minimum. And then from the minimum, give me a dead 90. And then just knock down the pole when you connect the dots. And you didn't even need to give me a second minimum. You could have... You could have just curved in and just realized... Just from, from the raw hook, looks a little bit better. Just a tiny bit, it looks a little bit better. Then, because one's going left, one's going right after all. Then, can reactivate and get these monorails bursting. Which is sick as fuck, look at them. So they get the angle for the turn and then they're traveling together. They keep coming back together. I like that, man. I really do like that now. I don't know about second station. Maybe a second station. Maybe like a second station. Like, but that's too close. Do you know what I mean? Like, 
you know you know i mean that's a big feature as well i like this big round that's the biggest loop in the park there that that, that biggest half loop right so i want to keep that i like the s i want to keep that so what do we do do you know what i mean what do we do we could just put a station on each side and just connect it somehow do you know what i mean and that would invariably change the route direction and i'd need to figure out again like i did on the first one how to link them up like that do you know what i mean So if I'm going to do that, station's actually going to be midway accessible over here, right? Now, on the interior line, my guy travels with the stairs to the right, yeah? On the exterior line, my guy travels with the stairs to the right. So we would need... these guys coming out going this way if I wanted the others coming out going this way that is him so he doesn't need to change he needs stairs on the right so if that was the case stairs on the right for him would look like that Yeah, stairs on the right for him would look like that. And then... This is my man. He's coming out. He's got stairs on the right. And, and I want him to be going the other way. So we would need... Where are we thinking? Out there. We would need out there then... stairs on the right to make him go that way stairs on the right to make him go that way where do you want that on the track you might need to just increase the track a pause thing regardless now over here is it possible is the question is it possible to ruin the track without trying to now I like big curve there I dislike little curve here I don't mind it. Small curve into bigger curve. Yeah. Maximum piece here could be removed to facilitate somehow a station going in. Now, a station goes in by putting, I don't know. I don't know. We just install the station. We just have to straight up install the station and bring this like back through it or something, right? Now, before we destroy all that and start fucking shit up per se I would like to reset the monorails now this is going south going south so that would be the southeast rail so this is Southeast station 
and this would be the southwest station. So now, starting from southeast, I'm going to go here, deactivate, northeast, deactivate, southwest station, deactivate, southeast, deactivate, south wheezy, deactivate, and there should be one more, north wheezy, deactivate. Now, boom should everything be deactivated scroll over there and you see now if you speed up the time and let the monorails come in let them wrap it up Don't want to see no monorails going. You should go in and stop. Oh, he's not stopping. Why is he not stopping? Has he got a reset or something? Maybe he's got, he's gonna go past another station now. So let's see what he does when he goes past that station. I took a swim. Whatever. I'm thinking they're supposed to be symmetrical. So how could he be fucking that up? Right. So he stopped. Where though? Oh, there's someone already in there. Yo, say what? If I activate you for one second. Is it going to push the monorail out? Can you see the train in the station? You can fucking not. It's the southwest station, so it's the southwest line that I want to actually be working. Activate that. Let's see the congestion up here change. waiting on this line
what is this congestion? I've got 100% transport rating without even creating anything else. Can't get the Southwest Lion activated. Hello, Babada. Hey, Georges. Hey, shut my door, please. Shut my door. Thank you, baby. Shut the door. <laughs> and take your jacket off. Changing your bum. Yeah. Don't bring it. Mm -mm -mm. Oh wow. It is still deactivated. Alright, so I fucked up my monorail system. So I'ma need So we're going to need to wait out the storm. As we say, it's his direction that needs changing.
that can't really happen to over here let's be honest the s the s that we're doing here is unnecessary and almost pointless and we could feature something in that s there do you know what i mean that's that's where we got to do it that's exactly where it has to happen in in this part of the s is where it has to go on so it's like a random bit as well isn't it because it's like you know where does it go this is where it naturally wants to go this is the way that I want to place it now so I might just have to destroy my favorite little curve here No, I'd prefer to do that interior. Can't lie. That keeps it sweet. Hello. <laughs> this needs to stay the same way, and it can't. Wait there. That is literally just a track reversal, that right there. Would have to just have it on the outside. Be careful. Don't be out here getting crazy in my studio, mate. Bye bye. It does work out in the best spot though. It's just facing the wrong way. But maybe with a little demolition it could happen, it's possible. To maybe just delete that section and then fit this thing in, look, it fits in.
I just want to up bad bitches For all the times I never had bitches Now I'm all up in that ass bitches Listen, don't worry about the lack of amenities, my G's. Yeah? This is the straight... Uh, shit, what's that? The Western Station. Yo, my monorail is still congested over here. What is going on, man? So while I'm fucking with the actual sandbox, I'm done with these storms. I'm done with these storms. Every time I'm trying to do something, that's the one thing that I'm trying to do as well is the fucking is 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 the one thing that doesn't need this fucking snowstorm shit in the middle of Nevada. For fuck's sake, look, keep covering the monorail tracks with the snow. Fuck's sake, man. Ugh. Ugh. We've bogged down the line. I don't know how. I know how. Yeah. Train gone. Do, 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 do. All trains gone. All trains gone. Now we wait. Now we wait for the monorails to kick off again. Come on, monorails, sync up. I don't know what the fuck I just saw. Deactivate the Southwest Station. Deactivate the Southwest Line. Yeah? So you go in there and you stop. Right? Cool.
deactivate the southeast line now so there's a monorail in every station now what the problem is is you're now going in the wrong direction question if we activated you would that send the monorail out that way So let's act like the monorail was just completed. Yay. Oh, now one other line is just randomly going in the other direction.
exterior lines are synced. What happens to this? A train has just come into a deactivated station. Because we dope as fuck can only get a two in the source. If I activate it now, what happens? I hang with a bunch of hippies and wacky tobacco planners. <sighs> Who swallow little roaches and light up like jack-o'-lanterns.
Way too much attention and OCD put onto that anyway. <clears throat> Uh, 
I love you in the shower Both of our bodies dripping wet On the kitchen floor Late at night you won't forget Right. Any madness. Any a madness bombo. Any a bombo clout madness. Eh? A witchy madness this. It is true madness is what it is. Crazy. I wonder if there's a way for me to actually mark that. <clears throat> Do you know what I mean? Like actually get the the middle line because I had the middle line once upon a time, didn't I? But I lost it. That's true. This may be nice. Oh, shit. What, and I can't get no linearity off it? Oh, my. Mm-hmm. 
There's only one way. There's only one way, and that could be done again. That could totally be done again. Oh, make you scream my name.
is not a bad move. I think that's a bit redundant in the face of that potential. Look at that.
Hey, yo, what? Oh my, there's some really good dinosaurs here. Oh my, there's gonna be a swingers, you know? There's gonna be a major swingers. I'm not even playing. I'm not even fucking playing. I'm jumping straight in. I'm gonna wait. Who the fuck wants to wait? I gotta do all of the genomes, right? Per egg.
Let's get a fucking Ferrazinosaurus in there. This is going to be hard as fuck. We're going for 10 exclusive mad things, big things though. You can't, you can't even do this without the Spinosaurus. I think the Ferrazinosaurus is a little bit too small, but he's in there now and there's nothing you can do. But the Y Tyrannus is also quite small as well. So let's get the Spinosaurus in there and see if that makes he will. He'll make a big splash, this guy. He's gonna get they're gonna get murdered by the hyper aggressive hybrids. Which I'm gonna throw in there. But there are at least three of those that could survive. Uh there are at least three of those that could dominate that threaten to dominate. So, you know, first, second and third place seems like I know who's gonna be competing. It'll be Scorpius, Indo Indo and something else we haven't we haven't done it yet but there's the spinner right and then we're gonna get Scorpius this is another heavily modified dinosaur so it's gonna be it's just gonna be a wild ride in there Now, I think Morris Intrepidus is getting in there, but we've got to get five, so there's going to be one. I think it's two, three, four, five right there, but. So the Giga, the Giga's getting in there. Unforgettably, Giga Null goes first on the list now, y'all. Gonna have a quick look at who else is around. Serrat will be too small. Khan will be too small. Good fighter, but too small. Allosaurus, good fighter, too small. Raptor, good fighter, too small. So, it is down near where I was thinking the whole thing... I already had it planned from looking at it once. I had it all ideaed out in terms of what I wanted to do. I knew it. the Indominus would be getting a look in there. Of course, the Indominus is getting a look in there. Wow, so three more. Now the Indoraptor is only just a little bit too small. I do think Megalo, Megalo 
he's got to get in there as well. Megalo really has to get in there. And he might have a... He does not, but it's fine. He's already good enough. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah, I'm in the studio. Yeah, I'm next door. You can't hear me because I'm next door. Yeah, that's why. You wanted to ring me, no problem. You can ring me anytime you like. Talk to Sunny. Who's that, Luba? Is that my Luba bear? <laughs> That's my Luba Luba. <laughs> Hello. I think my Jungasaurus has to get in there. He has to get in there. He's going to get capped, but I'm going to throw him in. Yes, baby. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Oh, who's that? Well, now you're going to echo and you're on live, so I don't want that. <laughs> Go on. Yes, but take the technology out because it's not funny. You're echoing. It's a feedback loop. Yeah, I can see you. And you're on the TV as well. Blatantly ignore Bye bye. <sighs> yes. Yeah. Lulu is talking to me. What do you mean? <laughs> Why is she not? Why is she not talking to me? Yeah. I'm gonna get the Metrocampus uh, Metriocamphosaurus in there. Yeah. Daddy didn't say anything, baby.
We're going to modify the few genes because I'm going to load up another lab. After they're out, I'm going to load up another one. <coughs> so we're going to have a 15 species interbrawl between hella dinos. I'm going to face them off Royal Rumble style -y. And it's going to be dope as hell. Let's have a look. So that would be you. All right, let's throw a Serato in there. Let's throw Serato in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hello. You was talking somewhere else. You wasn't talking to me. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Daddy loves ya. You okay? Right. Let's get a Kano in there. She. Hello. Mm -hmm. I am. Hello. Bye. hard to tell them to stop running when that's the whole point of the game there's literally the whole point of the game that they're, they're, they're playing right there the baryonyx is lightweight but i should throw the baryonyx in there anyway of course i'm throwing baryonyx in there baryonyx might have just broken down the door i think he's just broken down the door for a couple of us. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. At the moment, Baryonyx is looking like the last one. So he might be the fifth one. Knowing my uh, sort of OCD background operating system, I would assume that that was the case. <clears throat> so let us commence and see. We got hella modified genomes, right? Let's Let's see how many eggs we're going to get. So are we going to have a 15 on 15 or are we going to have a, yo, we're going to, I'm going to have to have both of these eggs. They're both looking hard as hell. And Dominus is just bringing one egg. Just one Indominus egg. Hmm. 
Megalosaurus. Five megas. Boy. That's creating a whole lot of stink. That is creating a whole lot of stink. And this, these things must be smaller because six of them are hitting. A whole pack of them are hitting the ting. Okay, Majungasaurus has got a big chance in there as well. He's coming in with five. Then the white Tyrannus. The U Tyrannus here is it's got five of them as well. That's gonna be excellent. Tyrannosaurus Rex with two. Some genetics some genetics defects there. Uh Ferrazinosaurus, just one. Just one. Yeah, yeah, hello, 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 stop being silly. So we're going to see. A big pack of the morals. Hey. Can you not stop screaming down the damn phone? Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye, baby bear. Screaming down my Ross Cleat phone every time I set the damn thing up. So. I'm thinking... Giganotosaurus versus T-Rex. We're bringing out T-Rex first. Comfortable dinosaurs are manageable dinosaurs. Oh dear. Some big boys in the picture already. What we got? Is this gate open? Right. Gonna have to pause. We need to name some of these guys. They're gonna get names. Hello. What's what? Am I what? Get off my phone. Get off my phone. Stop calling me phone. I'm next door. You bloody gay lord.
fun, excuse me. Let me sit down. Can you do funny face? No, I need to use my phone. Funny faces. No, there's no funny faces. There's nothing funny faces in that one. There are funny faces on there. Not on there. There, there. Are, there are. There are funny faces. Make it now quick. <coughs> oh, let's play that funny face. You will love it. Daddy, you will love it. Mm -hmm. That's a funny rabbit. That's a funny rabbit. Daddy, you are hot. Why was so funny? Oh, a bunny. I love a picture. <laughs> That's a funny. That's funny. Look in the big one. That's a funny. That's funny. That's funny. I'll see if I get facing to his mommy. What? That's like funny. Funny. Uh. That's a funny one. Let's make some um then what a pokeball What Pokemon are you? Open your mouth. You are a Voltorb let Daddy try. What are those heart things? They're us. What is that over me? I'm not teaching a lot. What things, what do things is a lot? Can I be a clown machine? Can I be a clown machine? Huh? Daddy, come on, I'm doing funny faces by Daddy. You're doing funny faces? Yeah. Show me your funny face. That was a rabbit. You're a rabbit? Yeah, that was a rabbit. <coughs> you're eating faces. Yeah, I don't know that's got funny faces. We'll have a look. Okay. What are you doing tomorrow?
Alright, um, it's probably taking ten minutes, so I'm not gonna put it to Fucking, I won't be able to phone you when I'm dead. Say again? Nah. Nah. Where do you want to meet? Oh, go tell you in the morning. Okay. Alright, well, don't worry, stay there, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna throw my, throw my wheels around trying to catch up now. So I am going to pop out. Two gigas with two Tyrannosauruses. Bastard. See if he gets in there before I go shot. Oh, he's on it. Double swingers, double swingers. Beautiful. <laughs> Scarred up. Breakout, yo. Imagine I come back and they've eaten everybody in the park. Survival of the fittest.
I didn't take my phone because I thought, ah, shit, I can't phone him, so I didn't take it. I'm an idiot. I, di I didn't think that you might phone me. I'm an idiot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, cool. We'll be doing the same.
my daughter's like a producer. Bo killed them both. Raw, what did they do? Buried him. Outstanding structure to you, the people. Now the dreams of a visionary have been fully realized, and an extraordinary experience awaits.
ladies and gentlemen, cast your mind upon these prehistorical wonders. Ginger baby boy, ginger baby boy, ginger baby boy, ginger baby boy, ginger baby boy. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner, Bo, and his backup, Rage. Who's not so ragey anymore. He's just going to be called Ra. So, we're going to need some competitors. going on over here so on the left we have five one 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 and on the right we have exilophone one five six five right so we're gonna release First start, we're going to hatch. Maybe a couple unexpected warm-up opponents, I don't know, but we're going to we're going to throw an Allosaurus into the mix who's already been incubated. Also, in terms of the ones, I'm going to throw a spinner in there. Look like a green spinner in there. Ladies and gentlemen, 
added to the Royal Rumble. Spinosaurus. You gotta get in there, though, Spinner. Uh, shut my door, please. Shut my door, yeah? Going to throw the Ferrazino in there. Vicious looking predator. Look at this mad thing. Just when you think you've seen it all, along comes the Ferrazinosaurus. And believe it or not, those huge claws you see, they actually help to feed on vegetation. Bye bye. Shut the door. Just do me one favor, okay? Shut my door. My door. The studio door. Indomie. Someone suffered a concussion somehow. Dommy's in there. Yo. Gonna release some randos. I do want to see who's a good swingers and not.
It's about to get carnivorous in there. Ah, you're cheeky. Um, shut that. The fuck. Bo was killed by Indy. Wow. Spinner and Spike, how is that going? Oh, that's part two. Ironically, tragic qualities of being a dinosaur that has been brought back from the dead die. But death has unfortunately come for one of our animals. Clear the carcass from the enclosure before it can spread disease. Fuck that. I'm gonna have to get ready for the ultimate Royal Rumble. Bo died as well. And Ra. Both died to Indy.
Wow. This dinosaur jumps, spins, hits its enemy. And then the other one just gets poisoned. Cut up. Indy might die like that. All right, Sal, fuck off. Cheeky bosses. Let's give him a reason. And it is a dinosaur that has what I like to refer to as presence. When it's around, you know it. This animal should make for a killer exhibit. I mean, it being a killer and all. Poison, you know. So I need the gate open. So boy. Do we have some exciting beefs? Are they beef beefing? That was Scorpius. That was where's Indy? Indy died of poison. Wow. Spinner. Spinner's on Sal. Time for you to dead, Sal. Poisoned.
kill Zhao. All right. Let's see then. If anything can fuck with Spinner. We're releasing a U Tyrannus. Just want to be in the hmm. Allosaurus in this bitch. Oh, my. I've got Rago in this bitch. Got Cardi A and Cardi B. Spinner died poisoned. Interesting. 
Andy died. I'm just gonna, f gonna fill the arena with some more of those tiny things. I didn't expect them to be so small. Spinner with the Meg. It's a good fight. Spinner is poisonous though. She's just going to win everything. has been labeled the cheater of its time. This is a hunter with terrific speed, power, and focus. The makeup is perfect for the storm. Just don't get spotted because there's no way you're going to outrun this one. Nice, Marta Taurus. You could recognize this predator immediately by the horns on its head. Which give it a real rock and roll appearance. They are super quick. Those powerful legs can get this dinosaur moving as well. So probably best to stay out of its way. This dinosaur is so metal. Let the cat out. A dinosaur. A dinosaur. No, 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 no. Are you ready? Are you ready? Furry dinosaur. Are you a furry dinosaur?
Suppose we gotta bring the Indoraptor into the mix, don't we? It's too big not to. I don't think we let any metric camps out. Cryolophosaurus, one of the more colorful members of the collection. It's a carnivore, so take the necessary precautions and don't let its looks deceive you. Here is a herrerasaurus. It's a carnivore and a spectacular addition to our dinosaur game. It just requires a little TLC.
So as far as carnivore, <clears throat> dinosaurs, goat. This will be the last one. I mean, there are more. But they're raptorish, leaving those for another wave. I got a feeling that Scorpius wins this, and with that means smaller and more numbers is going to be needed to take him out. Let's see. Let's see what happens. We've got a lot of fucking bullshit going on, so a lot of dead dinos. Let's have a look. Allosaurus is going mad in there. New Tyrannus died of unknown causes. This animal was instantly recognizable by the colorful crest on its snout. While smaller in stature than some of the other predators, it is not a dinosaur to be taken lightly, let me tell you. It's raptor time. Fuck it. There's only a few of them. Then we've got every fucking carnivore possible in the arena. <clears throat> and we're going to see who comes out on top. The only one that didn't really get the fair shout was Giganotosaurus. But we've got that guy. On back up on fleek. The streets remember. So yeah, look, there you go. I can tell which ones haven't been released because they haven't been modified. So... You know, it's probably about five or six left. I think a whole hatchery worth. It doesn't take long to modify each species. And you do modify the whole... The whole species at once, you know? My God, ten compies hitting the hitting the hood like that. So these are really intelligent. Those are spitters. These are these are some of the early early dinos. <clears throat> I like this one. Cretaceous, is it? has a skull similar to a crocodile's and a disposition that isn't that far off either. The Tsukamanmas originally fed on fish and small prey. Let's make sure it doesn't expand its diet into two-legged animals wearing collector t-shirts. It's a mistake making those di dinosaurs more uh, intelligent. 
they're already very intelligent. Personally, I don't think the Troodon gets as much respect as it should. It's one of those dinosaurs that seems like an evolutionary bridge, stuck in time and transition. The platypus of its day. And now, we're ours. It's also incredibly interesting to study and display. So make the most of this animal. Raptor, a truly tenacious hunter, and it is simply relentless. At least, that's what I'm told. <laughs> I don't intend to find out firsthand. Four left. Nathus is a small predator, but don't let its stature fool you. It can be a ruthless hunter. Finally get it. I finally understand why people have a fear of the dark. 
Once you peer into the shadows and see a pair of Dimetrodon eyes staring back at you, well, you'll be having nightmares for years. That's if you're lucky enough to walk away, because believe me, not everybody is. Shit, we was going well. We was going well. We was going well. I was doing well. I was doing well. I was doing well. I was doing well. Let's get back in. Crashed because I was clicking on shit. Spill it. Cause we do do do. understand why people have a fear of the dark. Once you peer into the shadows and see a pair of Dimetrodon eyes staring back at you, well, you'll be having nightmares for years. That's if you're lucky enough to walk away, because believe me, not everybody is. This dinosaur is important for a number of reasons. I mean, they're all important, but this one... The Deinonychus was the center of debate among paleontologists for many years. Specifically, were the dinosaurs cold-blooded or warm-blooded animals? With them alive and in the park, we have our answer. So let's increase populations of things that we don't have populations of, right? In terms of carnivores, we've got all of these guys. We don't have one of these. This dinosaur, the Dilophosaurus, has a distinctive neck frill it can expand when it senses danger. It's also been known to spit into the eyes of its prey, blinding it before it goes in for the kill. Chaos. I think this 
animal gets a bad rap. Back when fossils were all scientists had to go on, this Mongolian dune dweller was granted an egg boot. But you know what? It was really just looking out for its own. So as far as I'm concerned, the Oviraptor is all right in my books. Originating in Madagascar's Mahajanga province, a locale that would be where the Certainly something special about this one. Uh, je ne sais pas. It's a pyroraptor. Had it not been for a forest fire sweeping through southern France, our little feathered friend here may have gone undiscovered. And my life insurance would be just that little bit cheaper. <laughs> This dinosaur is one of the earliest known animals, dating back to perhaps 216 million years ago. It's called Coelophysis. Their remains can be found scattered across the globe. But if people want to see a Coelophysis up close, this is the only place to do it. You might think that the Sinosauropteryx is the perfect size for a cute plushie to take home. <laughs> But this dinosaur is a pretty mean hunter for something so small. Trust me, you really don't want this one snapping at your heels. Crazy. So the mad carnivore fest begins. We get to see who the realist is. Oh my God, this feathered bastard is on his back, bruv. Took it out. Took it out. Oh my. Gang. David and Goliath, man. That one's called Dave. going mad big boys are going mad in there big boys are running around big 152 visible dinosaurs in there now this beautiful open air setting offers a unique opportunity to see dinosaurs from the earth just as they roamed the planet millions of years ago fighting in coliseums like gladiators. Albertosaurus and Baryonyx is in there fighting. Really, it don't matter who kills who. 
Yo. Rap to fight. Rap to fight for dominance. Interspecies. Giganotosaurus is in beef. Raptors on the hunt. The Metrodon. Ooh, big boy's still around, bruv. Scratches on him. Lovely, lovely. Who's he fighting? He's fighting a Meg, is he? Brushes him off. Slowly going down. We're losing dinosaurs. By the second. We'll be losing dinosaurs by the second out here. fight this is a no chill zone should throw some herbivores in there man is just lonely you know Two quezzes are going at it. Look at this. Oh, shit. Gignotosaurus. Green Giga. He's fighting an Indoraptor. Is he He's fighting this Indoraptor here? He wants to. Swallow up one of the little ones, bruv, allow it. So I put them in there for the competition, you know. Spinner. Can't be called Spinner though, can he? Gonna call him Russ because he is a little gladiator still. Might just call him something else. Called him Wilder. Fuck it. On account of his little chicken legs. Cardi B. This is Cardi B. She's the second Cardi. There's another Cardi around called Cardi A.
Can you guys hustle back in? That is an indominus, bruv. The raptor is eaten. Tribe is fighting a Dilophosaurus right there on camera. Carnivore heaven. Well, don't know about heaven. Carnivore Colosseum. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Play the game. Yo, what the... Man is out on the bits, bruv. On the bits, like, walk on. What are you telling me? All right. Uh, people are going to be like running. Do you guys already know? Them guys don't already know. So before everybody just fucking starts panicking and 34 dinosaurs hit the road, we ain't got nothing to stop this from happening. We have nothing to stop this from happening. Now, it could be chaos. Or it could be just an immediate quick fix. I think an immediate quick fix is in order. Let's go for the operations. Because what I didn't bring in was like, I don't know, what is this shit called? This shit right here, you know? And what probably should be popping is like... Randomly is like that, and uh, yeah, and The repair is going to be constantly obstructed. Bear dinosaurs making runs for it.
Someone getting dragged up over there.
one dinosaur made a move. Fucking how many of them escaped? Just 33 dinosaurs left. The Giganaurus ate, ate someone with the mobile phone. soon to find out
There's an invisible electric fence there. It's just current push them, pushes them back. Sixteen dinosaurs left. Tribe is still there, yo. Wilder and Cardi. Oh, shit. Catch him going to sleep. Cardi got poisoned by the. You see, that's what comes out in the end. That's what that's what prevails in the end. Yo. Raptors are fucking up the big boy. The dinosaur is ringing. Yeah. 
He's a big boy cadet. He should have got something done. Don't you just want to go in and have a little look? They're after the flare. I got them all zerged on the flare. That's crazy. I didn't know that happens. Let me see you on in the air. So, the remainders, we got the big Cardi A. Probably the biggest dinosaur in the fucking thing. We have an Albertosaurus, an Allosaurus. Interestingly enough, I swear the Indy. Indominus Rex died in a fight with Cardi, which I did not see. With the big Cardi as well. I mean, shit. CZ has got internal bleeding. This is who I thought would win. This is who I thought would win. 8%. Dying slowly. She's apparently just sleeping. And you can see her breathing. We're down to seven dinosaurs in the building. Now, I can't really see them all because of the smoke, but you don't know what's there. We got another little raptor in there somewhere. There's that. It's pretty small. It's fucking eating. Eating the other dinosaur, bro. Fucking hell. I see no little ones. There's no competition for the big ones, then the little ones. Look, they're just dead in there. Starved to death. Starved to death because it couldn't make any kills. CZ is going to die. There he goes. Infamous murderer, this guy. 11 fights. Made 9 kills. Tsh. 
mad thing. Those were crazy. You gotta be, you gotta be bad, you gotta be bold, you gotta be wiser. Cadet died in a fight with rags. Q is up. Raggo the Allosaurus. This guy's a bad man, you know. Six dinosaurs left, so it's Q, Cardi, Raggo. Who else is in there? Tribe is in there. My money would be on Tribe. That's just four, though. There are still two I'm not seeing. One's just got off the floor. No, it hasn't. This one's got low health. Cardi A. Gorgeous specimen, this guy. Fucking gorgeous. Q just died randomly. Gonna give him a name and he was killed. He's killed by tribe. Tribe has got I got my money on tribe for the win, to be honest. I don't know. Four dinos left. You can see all four of them. Tribe, Cho, Rago, who's just killed Cardi. Wow. He's a bit of a boss. He's a bit of a boss. So 200 dinosaurs has come down to three. 200 dinosaurs has come down to three pretty much, right? We have, I believe this is an Indoraptor, which, yeah, a late edition. Chodiobertosaurus is in there. And Raggle the Allosaurus. Again, two mildly late editions in terms of Carnivora. I was bringing in the, you know, the Scorpius killed most of them. I don't think we'll have long to play until these guys start f fucking fighting. Here it comes. <sighs> they saw each other and walked away. Very similar dinosaurs, these guys. Other than the fact that this one is a smaller class. Here we go. I don't know how he did it, but he got him done. Is he dead? Cho is risking it. He 
He's gone to sleep. Right in front of Tribe. Who may just win this fight. Because Cho has just gone to sleep right in front of him. The Allosaurus is busy. Might he murder him in his sleep? He's he's interested, isn't he? But I don't think he will. He might wake him up and start beef, though. Yeah, look, beef. As he wakes up, tribe goes away. Three dinosaurs, three feeders. Stay there, there was a fight right there. Here it is. This is one of the championship fights here. This is it. This is for third place. This is for third place. Rago is losing the fight, I think. King Rags is out here losing somehow. Oh, big bite. Big bite. Tribe's got double his health. Rago retreats. Currently in third position. If that carries on, Cho will win. Tribe will come second. If that carries on. Rago's got internal bleeding. He's gonna die. Third place for Rago. Championship fight will come down to Cho and Tribe. And right now, Tribe has the lesser of the two. But he is healing. He is healing. I could save Rago. I could fix this fight. I could try and fix this fight. It hasn't been natural anyway. So I'm going to fix the fight if I've got the... If I've got the speed. Oh, I haven't got the... I need... I do need to put gates straight where I can go in, you know, just and gone. Shit. This ain't what's needed to help him. This ain't what's needed to help him at all. I tell you what is needed to help him is not that. It's actually not any of this. It's it's down here, isn't it? Like an asshole. Yeah, you forgot completely what it was. Carthage says we're nice.
this might have been a bit slow. Oh, man's not looking at the invisible gate properly. Saved your life, boy. Rago has maybe earned the right. Oh shit. Cho and Rago started beefing and then Cho just went to sleep again. Cho has done this a couple times. Oh my. Let's have a look at what we got here then. Okay, we tra travel with Rago, the Allosaurus, who has pretty much It's pretty much become one of the kings. These guys are getting prepared for the fight. Look, they're tired before the fight. They're both alphas. Cho and Tribe. It's an Albertosaurus. Wow. Who just flukily survived with a lot of luck. I don't think he's had many fights. He's had five fights. He's kind of made four kills, they say. And I don't know what this, this is. I think this is like how many people he's eaten. Meanwhile, this guy's had many more fights, double the amount of fights, made double the kills. <clears throat> general level of bad boy, this guy is a general rude boy. So we need to work on this dinosaur here, look. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Tribe and Choke. Cho does it again. Cho does it again. This is an illegal move. This is a trick that he's pulling off. They might get me vex off. I think we're going to have to see. Is it really a herbivore? It's really a herbivore. Wow. So we didn't actually see any of these. Let's 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 maybe throw one of these or a couple of these as a challenger in there. Might do some winner stays on. There's really only three kinds of dinosaur, right? None of these herbivores are actually modified other than that one which is an omnivore and Ferrazino Ferrazino no genome going in there alright the king is back the king returns. The king returns and is hungry. I <laughs> oh, love kids. The shit that they're shouting is just amazing. They're the, they're, the, they're the shit. They really are the shit. Show just sleeping all the time. It, it comes to beef and his defense mechanism is to just go sleep. They're all considered kings because they are you know, fucking unique species. None of them are the same. Yeah, we threw some dickheads in there. Huey, Dewey and fucking Louie. No, it might not, but you never know. I just 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 food at the moment. <sighs> Coward.
So we've got Howard, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Chinger in there. So now we should see some authentic beef. Oh, 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 oh. Huey started straight beef. They are beefing. Slash fest. No, don't be stupid. Fuck. Tribes picking one. Tribe calculating his look here. So there's a there's a fight for everyone. Cho and Rago are beefing, yo. That's a mad one. I got a feeling Cho just gonna go to sleep. What kind of defense is that, my G? So Cho's gonna win this just because he can't fall asleep all the time. He's just gonna fake sleep in the middle of beef every time, yeah? Is that what he does? Is that his little thing? I think I might throw some fucking raptors in there. Like throw a tribe to back tribe up. Throw in a tribe of raptors. See the raptors, they beef each other. So, no problem. Because I reckon they won't give him much of a chance like that. I reckon they'll just jump on him. Don't know how he survived before now. Or up to now, should we say. Cho and Rago checking each other out again. This dinosaur has a major fracture. Who died? Killed by tribe, Huey. Huey died in a fight with tribe. Come on. Nice. Mm-hmm. 
What, just a normal raptor with the... Look, three of them are going to take out the big thing. Look, 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 look. Took him down. Three more that haven't gone in yet, you know. Let's bust that gate, look. Let them see what it is. This one uninterested. I might have to go in there and shoot him. Tribe and the Raptors immediately tribe looking for dominance. Immediately tribe looking for dominance. Soon as the group get too big, look, he's on it, he's on it, he's on it. Zuss, fuck out of here. Snapped his neck one time. He's heard about the commotion, he's on his way now. Let's go. Gate open for you, bruv. Get in there. I don't know what you had planned to do tonight. Rago and Dewey is in there fighting, okay. So this is supposed to be the king. He's the fake king. I'm gonna call him Oz. That that chicken is looking for a way. Dinocurus, Dinocurus, Kavis. We're going to have to trank the king, I tell you what. Or get in there. Boss one off. we have here is 10 dinosaurs. Five raptors. Tribe, Rago. Cho's still there. Howard's in there and I don't know what else is calling it 10. Because I only count nine. Tribe giving it. There's another one. There's another one. There's another one got his neck snapped. Are we immediately down to nine? So it's, it's four raptors. Three big boys. That's seven. And one duck. And I don't know what else is supposed to be alive in here. 
Cho fake sleep again. Cho. This is still alive. It's just starving. It's starving because it's a herbivore. It eats fish, but I ain't got no water in there for them. And you might think, oh, what a cunt. It's a fucking herbivore. It's just there to spice up the beef. Let's get rid of these fucking corpses. Invisible gate here, look. Magnetic one, yeah? So speed it up until we can get some fucking beef. Cho's got up off the floor. Now, I haven't seen Cho get serious yet. I have not seen Cho get serious yet. I need to see him get serious or I'm going to disqualify him. Cho might just get disqualified. He's the biggest dinosaur in there and yet he keeps... Hey, look, look. Look, there he goes. That's a disqualification. That's a cheeky disqualification, that is. Look, he just, he just falls asleep. Even fighting a herbivore, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Tranquilize choke. Well done to you, mate. Well done to you. You fucking cheated your way out of the arena. Yo, they jumped on Cho. No, they jumped on Rago. This is what I was hoping they would do to Cho, but they jumped on Rags. And there is nothing I can do about it. Rago is dead already. They're digging him up. It's just an autonomic response at this point. Him dead out here, man. Him dead. Wonder if you could save him. Scoo! Ah, this is the wrong unit. Totally in it. This is totally the wrong unit. Fuck. Screw part two. This is really fucking slow. I think they've got him up still. Yeah. Tranquilize Osman. man. 
Fuck off, Cho, man. Lazy bastard. What was you? He was an Albertosaurus, right? Boring cunt. Disqualified. Disqualified from the Royal Rumble. Did you get him? I might have started a feedback loop here. Did you see the monorail network? All around the park, rude boy. All around the park, rude boy. Yeah, nothing really going on just yet in the park in terms of enclosures. Yeah, we got, well, we've got a main pyramid in the middle, but don't worry about that. That's Yaga. It's been through many storms already. People are here to see me breed the hardest. The hardest bastard. We're trying to breed. Okay, this is this is taking madness. This is this is mad. People are like, yo, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, I I know, bruv. I know. They glitched. Obviously, we knew this. Let me try. What is he? Bro, we fucked up. Y'all were just gonna get killed off by a tribe. A tribe are just murdering you guys. So I don't know what happens after we... Save it, load it.
No way. Okay, he's dead. And everything is as it should be. Okay. Oh shit, Tribe and Louie. Louie's a dead man, bruv. One quick spin flick. Oh, it's a bite. It's a jump bite. He's gone stiff. He's hit the deck. That is a hard hit. He's out. We are close to having a winner here. So, Oz. Now, I don't know what three dinosaurs we've got in there, but... That's why. Without tribe... Without Rago, there are three dinosaurs left in this arena. Let's try with his two. So we see what happens now. I feel I feel that because, oh shit, Tribe and Oz for the leadership, is Oz still the leader? Oz is the leader. This will default Sir as the leader. Once he gets brought down and his neck gets snapped, that will default him as the leader. He's going to be in there on his own. Woke up, chose violence. Okay. Now I feel like though, Big up Lemon Soda, Wagwa, my J. I do feel like because of the disqualification of Cho, we have to replace Cho. And Cho was a cunt. So, I'm going to replace Cho with someone who I didn't, who I feel didn't get really good representation. Even though I gave them two chances. Yeah. We're going to get a Giganota in there. Giganotosaurus in Egg Bay 2 coming up. And then in Egg Bay 1, unlucky. For the Albertosaurus. I should bring him back. I should bring him back. I feel like maybe bring him back. It was actually an Allosaurus. And he didn't get his fair swing. And I could remake the whole thing. But we'll see if there's a genuine heir to the throne. And I mean, obviously, Tyrannosaurus didn't get much of a look. Even though I threw two of them in there. They didn't get much of a look for some reason. There was there was beef blockage. Beef blockage. So the Giganoto is coming in with four eggs, and I think might just throw some Tyrannosauruses in there just because it's only is that four or did I say I said four? But did I mean to say four? Is that two eggs? I believe that might just be two eggs. It's fucking two eggs, so this would be four eggs now. 
right? And then obviously three eggs is coming off the Allosaurus. Now this one of them, I think they just do it anyway. I think it might be part of their opening animation and we're going to see. But the one that got named and that died on a bug, just on a glitch, lucky glitch, is unlucky. I set, I set a pack of raptors in there to kill Cho. And they didn't kill Cho. They set on Rago, but they glitched him. Bared him, jumped him at the same time, and they glitched him. So he was standing there twitching out. We had to reload it. And, and I don't think he would have died, I'll be honest, because he was fucking up the place. He, as he come out of this door, headbutted the door off. He's the only person, well, person, only dinosaur to have fucking done that so far. Like, headbutt the door off. Right? Now, these guys... They were the first released, but that meant that they were in there while I went shop. There were two good representatives just like this. Just like this. So these are the... Yeah, okay. 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 Not wrong gate, brother. I wouldn't wrong gate. Let me open the invisible, the magnetic gate. Open that magnetic one down there for you. And then you can go in. Wait, 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 wait. Who else got murdered? So this is it. The king of the ting really is tribe. We knew tribe would be the king of the ting for a while. It would have been it, it, it would have been Scorpius, but he, he he had some internal bleeding, which I didn't get down with. I wasn't into fixing it. I was happy to let him go because he was poisonous. So getting in a fight with him, it meant that you died anyway. At some point, you're going to die. Right, so the gigas are in there. We didn't incubate the, the Rex eggs. Let's incubate the Rex eggs and the aloes are going to be ready. So now, release the aloes and let's see. Watch, watch. Nah, he didn't even do it properly. There was, there was a black one, like that one at the back. And as he come out, he headbutted the door. A little bit the way that he did that, but it was different. It was different. So the aloes are in there. I think the aloes are standing a good chance. Now, maybe there's a wild card to get thrown in, but I don't think so. Maybe. Because the Tyrannus going in there. Who else didn't really get the representation that they're looking for? Just one more quick browse. Shouldn't be any filters. I didn't even see the Baryonyx fight. I didn't even see the white Tyrannus do anything. Indies. I don't even know how the Indies got caught. The Megas and the Metric Camps. The Majungas didn't even really see them get caught either. Indo Rap's been in there. Giganos in there now. All right, I think that's I think that's actually it. Barry, Barry, I didn't really see him fight either. The Kano and the Serato are two that I like as wild cards to throw in there. But there were some there were some brilliant performers. We're gonna bring back a crowd favorite. This guy was a crowd favorite. One more time, though. Quick scan over the list. You was a crowd favorite. I think... Wild card business should go on. And I'm going to throw some Carnos in there. Release the Rexes. Let me have a look at the Carnos. Look, Rex is ready. Are they crazy genetically altered, yeah? Alright, so tribes fighting off the first Allosaurus here. The Giganos saw the Gio, the Gigas are going at it.
Aloe with the T-Rex. Yo. Just name them quickly after after one of the instant characteristics that they show. And then I short on it to create something unique for them. So boy, there's a big boy coming back. There's another big boy coming back. Here's my wild card for a, can a Kano and the Serato in there. Not A, the actual whole, like there'll be a whole pack of these guys. Yeah, look. Kano's are going to have to get released. There'll be a few of those. Yeah, little devil man. Little devil man Tinguan and them guy there is devilish. Release the Serratos. We're still incubating quick checks for last additions to the fight now. Crowd favorites. We never saw. We got Giggers. I mean, you didn't really get a chance. How many? Yeah, you didn't really get a chance. I don't know if we're going to even give you another one, to be honest. The Majunga's too big, too small too small all of you guys had your chance and there's 20 of you you all had a chance yep that's it Spinosaurus could get thrown in there as a wild card but I don't like him too favorited in the beef no one saw this so here's a third wild card I didn't get to see this shit fight so I've thrown it in there. Something got to fight the fucking bastard in it. So let's throw a spinner in there. Serratos are getting released. How many eggs? Five. I want to get to watching some of these beefs now. Let's go. T Rex. Jays, Jays. How'd you die? Wow, the Allosaurus is straight dead. That's what I'm saying about crowd favorites. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's beautiful. I'm gonna call him Len. But he's on beef straight away. Y'all need to get the fuck. Alright, you know what? You know what? You know what? I need to. Before it gets too late. Because it will. It will get uncontrollable soon. Take the fucking ball by the horns. Sorry, lads, to uh Oh what can't drive past a dead body like that. That's crazy. So the, the floor must have been littered before, you know. Alright, geezers, 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 geezers. Can everybody just please sort of fucking make their way into the team? Alright. Hit the car if you want. I don't give a shit. They're knocking the car about. So everybody's sort of moving. Get rid of the body. Get the egg out. The spinner egg is on the way. You Tyrannus are out. Give me this guy again, because I just don't believe that that one flare was enough.
Chill spinners on Ack. All right, so behavior should get back to normal any minute, and we're going to see who really is the winner here. We've got a couple of raggo animals. Here we go. First fight now. Serato versus the Carno. These are the wild cards. These are the, There's a pair of wild cards thrown in there, these guys. He can't handle no more. Oh, Tribe are going straight in with someone. Lens in a fight. Oh my Len, oh my Len, well done. That was a major, major move by Len. So we got a fucking kill in there, that was a kill. That's a kill. Let's kill clean up on aisle one. Let's have a look. I got a carny. He's just mash up a Y. A U. We got Serato. He's looking to mash up a U. He gets hit by one instead. over here love the look of him he looks alpine knocks him knocks him okay we've got a couple wild cards dead oh wait 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 oh 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 man down Man down. Yeah, okay. Big man in the thing, yeah, okay. Couple bodies. A couple bodies out here. Look at this throughout all of that tribe just sleeping, bro.
Oh, Len and A's. Mad swingers. This is a big boy swingers. This is a big boy swingers. Len's got him. Len has got him. Twisted. Put down. Okay. You're out. Bully. In there just bullying. Ah, look, that is bullying. Look, he's got a good name because he's picking on a little one. Look. So, Ray is a carno. He likes to run from what we see. And his opponent is generally a braver one than the others. This is an Allosaurus. I think that he might survive. I don't know. He's playing it. He's playing it slick at the moment. Hayes is out of here. Yeah, couple of the wild cards out of there. Another one murked. Just big boys left. Pure big boy. Yeah, I am. Why? Well done. Screaming. Yes, what's crazy about him is he's got it. Alright, cool, can you take it please? It's like what it is.
you want to. Come and see them if you want. So it's really just big boys left. Yeah. You don't like it. Just bad boys. Everybody's heavily injured. Oh shit. One of the smallest guys in here. Oh shit, my money would have been on him. But he's been grabbed by the nose. And now on the neck. And he is out. D put him down. Mad ting. King of the Carnivores coming up. 
We are down to 11. We're nearly in the top 10. Tribe has been here since phase one. A couple of them have had a couple rebirths. This is Tribe. Starting a fight with one of the wild cards. Mm. Oh, brought him down. Went for the neck. Oh dear. Clean up on aisle three. Bully's dead. Bully got murdered by someone. He could have just died from bleeding. Bully was not the last of the Tyrannosaurs. We got some real big boys in there now. Mm hmm? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Yeah. So this one has been bugged out for the longest time. He's going to have to get gone. It's telling you what. All right. Oh, you're doing the numbers? Oh, yeah. It's teaching you, you need I know what you mean. Yeah. The what back to normal? The people where? On my game or your game? On your game. All right, let's 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 have a look. On my game, you don't know anything about my game. My game's about dinosaurs. Yeah.
excuse me, teaching my daughter how to write off cam. <laughs> 10 o'clock in the night. Um, right, so, okay, bad boys. Bad boys is still going on. Now, I want to see what the grading difference is between that. You can do it, baby bear. You can see it. Okay, so it throws uh, some more, some more Nucci's in there, which I don't even mind. It is teaching you, yes, baby. <laughs> Growling at the fan. Yo, who's getting eaten? By the way, oh, D went down. So, okay, and when we come up, it's Mike. That's so you died to Tribe. And then Tribe's just sleeping next to you. And now your brother Mike is just eating you. Mike don't like the taste of you. But. Now he's lonely. Huh. Who died? Dread. So that's in a fight with... <sighs> I thought so. So no matter what the handicap is. Yo. 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 Amazing. If I see him beat Len, that would have been amazing. But he takes that victory anyway. He just took that as a victory. Tyrannosaurus is out. There's just no shout for the Tyrannosaurus. Giga's in there, but there's no shout for the Tyranny. Should we airlift one special one in there? Maybe even two. What are we down to? I keep giving the un the we're down to six. I keep giving the the, the Tyrannosaurus an unfair chance, but it is the king. It's not going. I'll check it now. Let's have a look. You know what you're doing? You know what you're doing? You do it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, here we go. Big fight. Big fight. I'm rooting for K. I fucking hate the Spinosaurus. Really rooting for K. Come on, K. You can win this. He's not winning, though. It's a very, very close fight, though. It's all about who gets the big shots in. K takes a concussion. Acts down. He's still going. He's still going. I've got a fucking Tyrannosaurus on the way for you, bitch. I 
feel like throwing an endo in there just for the sake of it as well. I don't know what was capable of killing the endo. Oh shit, Mike might get his comeuppance here. Super close fight between him and Tribe. Tribe is, is kind of the natural winner of the last game in a way. He's the gladiator to beat. Smallest one with the biggest issues. Might throw an indie in there just to get things really violent. I still didn't see this thing working. I'm going to release one of them. They have no idea what that means. Blue ones mean we got inbound. Dark. Big fight. Big fight. Last of the little ones. The last of the little ones. K could have survived. Rematch between Tribe and Len going on, but that's going to be a slow paced fight, but definitely one to watch. In the background. In the background, the Giga goes down. The Giga goes down. Oh no, the Giga goes down. Small one in the background. Tribe looks like he's winning that fight as well. Small guys versus big guys. Rex is on the scene. Oh, big fight, big fight, big fight. King is here and he's getting released last as if he has you know I'm going to get the gigas one more go I'm terrible F 
fresh gig is going in there. I can't believe this guy took down a giga. He really, that's a wild card and a half. Do you know what I'm saying now? And I threw those carnies in. He's the last one as well. He's the last. He's the last and now he's going to go down. Now he's going to go down to what might as well be the first. Definitely going to get him in. Too agile. Turns up. Straight jumped on him. Ruthless. Ruthless. Said, what are you doing here? This is a big boy. Big boy thing, what are you doing here? Removed him instant. Instantaneously. All right, super big boys in there. And some hard rappers. This guy's a hard rapper. I could go in there and help him, but I don't wanna. I've done too much for him. I should go though. Triber just managing his health intelligently in there. If I could do it remotely, I think I. Mike and Len just had a beef. That's another big fight. So we got Bonnie. Here comes Clyde. Clyde is aggressive, I like it. Okay. We might want to get the fuck out of here. There you go, big boy.
the man they just got moved to. Oh. Clyde Merked Mike. Wow. Clyde is a giga. Bonnie is a giga. Clyde is a dead man. Clyde ran on one percent. Is regenerating really quickly. Did he literally go and heal? Nice. What do you need? Oh, yeah. Turn it up a bit. You can turn the volume up a little bit. You know that, right? Turn the volume up. Turn it up a little bit. Alright, 
Fight Club commences. We were on 10 and we lost K. Man, man, man murked Mike while he was, while he was sleeping. I tranked him and he murked him. Should really just get rid of uh, the guy that did that, but whatever. All right, we're going to have to save. And then reload that. I believe because you get these uh, moments where it doesn't hold up. Once we got King of the Carnivals. I'll open the door to the enclosure and just let him let him feed on the people. <laughs> no, I'm an idiot. I have done that. Carnivores. LT, who is the top, the top, the top Tyrannosaur, is actually losing heavily in a fight with Tribe. Bonnie and Capo. That's Bonnie. That's Capo. Indominus was just fighting Vin. Capo takes that round. We got a lot of people in need of rest. I can't believe Vin is still here. This, this guy's a G. He's an absolute G. Five wins, two kills. Yeah, it's like a real T-Rex. Do you want to look at it? Yeah. Come on in. Come sit in. You okay? You need to use the toilet? No. All right, come on in. Let's have a look at the dinosaurs. Oh, that one's a big one. Right, yeah, there is a big one, look. It's sleeping. Let's take a look at him. He's sleeping. Sleeping, yeah. Sleeping, and then look, we've got another one. We've got another one. It's, a, it's another one. Yeah, this one's Vinny. And then we've got Len. It's nice and smooth and orange. There's more, there's more. Look, they're fighting. Angry. It's angry. Another one. It's S a baby one. It's a small one. It's not a baby. He's just very small. Oh. He's, the huh? he's the oldest. He's the oldest. He's beaten. Beat That's the mommy T Rex. Beat up everybody. This is. The mommy T Rex. Yeah, it is indeed. Oh no, no one beat him. Oh, he's being stalked. The big one's gonna get him. It's a Spinosaurus. A Spinosaurus, yeah. A long tail. It's a long dinosaur. It's a long dinosaur. Yeah, he got long. Now he he got long legs. Long legs, long tail. Um, it's a long uh, one. It's a long one. He's a long one. Ah, oh, look, he broke his broke his claw. He broke his claw. Oh no. Sorry. Oh. Uh, 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 
another one. Another fight. People are watching, look. All the people are watching. Can I watch them too? Yeah, let's watch them. What? That's with the people. Look, the people say it's a T Rex. The baby T Rex is about to hatch. Oh, they're not hatching soon. Now that one. Long. Oh, it has a long tail. How? It's got a long Ooh. tail. Oh, he might he might get beat up. Oh no! He got him! He got him! Oh my gosh! Vin is the Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. He been eating. Mafia. He he Got him, you got him, look. Got him, I gotta get him out of here. Gonna pick him up with the helicopter. Gonna make the helicopter come and get him, look. Helicopter come and get him and take him away. I can't handle it no more. Oh, oh, she went down as well. She went down as well. Bonnie is down. Bonnie is down. That is. That's another T Rex. There is one more T Rex in there. The rest, they're not all T Rexes. This one is a Giganotosaurus. This is a Spinosaurus. You see with the thing on his back? That's a Spinosaurus. Spinosaurus. This is the T Rex right here. This is the T-Rex, look. No. Yeah, that's, that's the, not right. That's the T-Rex, look, it's sweaty. Oh, no. He'll be mean to. We have to get a helicopter to get him out. The helicopter's going to get them out, yeah. they got to fight first. That's what they're here for. They're here to fight for me. Now that one has a long time. Now we have to get a long Lazy dinosaur. Land. Yeah. Out. Now we have to get the long dinosaur out. Oh we look. have to get the long dinosaur out. We've got to wait until they fight first. Let's see who wins. We have to get that long dinosaur out. This one. We have to get that long dinosaur out. No, they're all good. They're all fine. They're all fine. They're all happy. They're all gonna be in there. He's got a broken claw. But he's gonna fight anyway. Um, Spinosaurus is sitting down. Look. Looks like Sandy. Yeah. Sitting down. Sitting down. Oh. Big green one. Oh. Looks a little bit dizzy. Oh, he's gonna get hurt. The big green one is out. The last of his kind. The last of his kind. Shall I save it? We should save it. Let's save it. We gotta save it. Quickly. Yeah, we have to try to help him. He might get hurt. He might get hurt. Tribe might get him. Tribe's got him. Tribe's got him. Oh no, Tribe's got him. Ah oh, no. Tribe got him. We have to get the helicopter. Oh, we tranked him. The helicopter. We tranked him just in time. We need to get the that helicopter. That is amazing. We to saved pass. him. We have to get the helicopter. Let's get the helicopter. Let's get the helicopter back. Oh. Take it to go fix it. Vin has got problems. 
he could also get saved by the trank. He's fighting uncle. He's looking to run. He's been hit. Oh, wow. A helicopter. So we put Vin to sleep. We put Vin to sleep, right? Now we need to get to Charlie. And then we've got to get Clyde and Vin both to the hospital. Let's get Clyde to the hospital first. Now let's get him to the hospital. He doesn't get... Capo might hurt Vin while Vin is sleeping. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. Yeah, hopefully not. Look, we're dragging him in the air. Look. Dragging. The helicopter's got him. Now the helicopter is getting him to the hospital. Yeah. He's been hit. Oh dear. The other one got to the hospital. Yeah, we've got to get two of them into the hospital. This is just one. We have to get two of them in the hospital. So we can fix him up a little bit. Look. No, we can fix him up. And put him back. Now put him back. Acknowledging Where he belongs to there. He belongs to there. Yeah, he goes back in there, and then we're gonna put. So we have to. Vin. We've got to get Vin in there. Back in the hospital. We've got to get Vin back in the hospital. So we got to Vin. So we can make him better, yeah. Let's get him to the hospital. So we can look at him. So we can look at him. Oh no, that one Vin. Vin is the bravest. Quinn has gone. That, that is... Quinn caught you. The huh? other one is coming back. <gasps> they got him. Oh, we got... Oh, just before... Oh, man. Wow. Wow. Oh, that one's broken down. Yeah. We have to, go, we have to put, get him out of there now. Because the Spinosaurus bit. got him. The Spinosaurus got him. Look. No. I don't like the Spinosaurus. It's not a good one. It's not a good one. Look, he's got the big thing on his back. Um. Oh, he's eating. Look, he's eating. It's not bread. No, it's not bread. It's meat. Yeah, it's meat. It's meat. Other creatures. Oh, the helicopter. Yeah. yeah. We have to get Vin to the hospital. We get Vin out of there, yeah. It's unfortunate because Vin was very brave. We're down to the last six. Eating meat. Ah, he's eating the meat. Look, that one's eating the meat. Oh, he eats it already. Oh, that was being crazy. That was being crazy. <laughs> that was being crazy too. He might run. There, get him. Get him, tribe. Get him, tribe. Get him, tribe. Get him, tribe. He might run. Come on, yeah, he might run. He might run. Get him, tribe. He's gonna run. Look, he's gonna run. Oh. <laughs> Oh, 
in here. Oh, watch out for that. Watch out for that. Oh. Who's up? Clyde got beat. Oh, he's up again. Has he up his hand? No, he was, he was, he was chilling and then I got up. Oh, uh, now let's go down. Now let's go down again. He's sleeping. He's not sleeping very much. Got a headache. Now he got the headache. Now, now he got to bring him to the hospital. He got to bring him to the hospital. No, he's okay. No, he's, no, he's got up. up. He's up. He's up. He's, he's going to beat him. He beat him. No, that's not, that's not him. Uh, oh, tribe. Oh, tribe. He jumped him. He jumped him. Poor Len. We have to get him to the hospital. Oh, let's get him out. We have to get him to the hospital. And then there were five. Now that one got the helicopter. Spinosaurus, Indominus. Indoraptor, Gigantosaurus, and Tyrannosaurus. That was in the hospital now. Yeah. Gentlemen, Let's go hide on the technology. That one beat him. Oh, there she is going to the left. Oh, Tribe, no. No. Tribe just selects who he wants to go for and, and does the job. Oh, no. We have to get him to the hospital. Oh, oh, that was there. That was great. Can we get out of there? He was out. He's bound to fall. Now they're full. Now they're full. Dominus got him. Good. Oh, bagged him. T bagged him. He bagged him. We have to get him to the. Oh. Level three. Tribe gets Clyde. This was. Oh, no, not this again. This was predictable. <laughs> I'm watching them. Oh dear, that one. Clyde is not dead. Somehow Clyde is not dead. Can I watch Clyde? There he is, look. This is Clyde. This is Clyde. He got down. Yeah, he looks very dead to me. I'm going to save it and see if Clyde is in third place. I don't know. There's nothing for third place, so he don't get anything. He don't get anything. He live on the third place. Yeah, you don't get anything for third place because you'll be on, you'll be gone, you'll be finished. Ah, uh, it's finished. It's finished. No, it's not finished. I'm bringing it back. It's bringing it back. Yeah, yeah. It belongs to there. Yeah. Now that was for the robots. And now it's for the robots. Yeah. Mm. In my hands. Yeah. There we go. Let's go. Tribe and Clyde. Oh, Tribe and Clyde are going. Tribe and Clyde are going at it. This is it. This is the part two. No, there are two dinosaurs. This is the part two. Oh. No, there are two dinosaurs. Yeah, there are two. They're fighting. They're fighting. No, there are two dinosaurs. No, there are two. Well, there will be two after this. No, there are two. There's three at the moment. Oh, there's three. Yeah, because there's one over here. Look. He's sleeping. He's just watching. Yeah, he's watching. Now there are two dinosaurs. Three, three, there's three, there's three, there's three. Everyone, there's three. Everyone's tired, look. Everyone's tired, he's sleeping, look. They're sleeping. He's sleeping. Now they're sleeping. They're going to sleep. He's sleeping. Now let's go. 
No, let's go back. Can we go? Can we send? Can we send back? Oh, they're sleeping. We're going to leave them alone. I'll let them wake up. Mama. Oh, he's up. He's up. He's up. He's up. He woke up. He woke up. He's He's going to get him. He's going to get him. He's going to get him. Oh, they're two. Now they're three. Oh, he's gone. And now they're two. We're now down to two. We're going to find out who's the king. Now they're two again. There's only two. There's only two. We're going to find out who's the king. The Tyrannosaurus is the king. Tyrannosaurus is gone. It's this Rex. T Rex is the king. It is, yes. Oh dear. No one got to the So now we see. Now there's two dinosaurs. Are they fighting straight away? Now there's two dinosaurs. Now there's two dinosaurs. Indy don't care. I can't believe Tribe is still here. <gasps> Tribe is in me. He is. Now there are two dinosaurs. Now there are two. Yo. Now there are two dinosaurs. Who will be the king? Who will be the king? Who is the king? Let's go. Let's find out. Big one or little one, baby? Who do you think will win? Big one or the little one? The big one or the little one? <gasps> the little one. The it's, it's the closest fight ever. It's running. It's running. The little one ran away. Oh, wow. It's running. It's running. He's sleeping. Oh, he's sleeping. He's going to have a rest. No, there are two dinosaurs. He's not sleeping. He's going to have a rest. Oh, he's wake up. Yeah, he's up again. He's ready. He's ready. What? He's ready, big boy tribe. <gasps> but now there are two dinosaurs. 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 Now it's having... Now it's watching. Now he got up up again. Now there are two dinosaurs. Now there are two dinosaurs. Yes. Now okay, 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 but it's too. Wait for the two to get some fight now. Now there's two. Shush, they're waiting for two. Two. What that was? What do you want, repeat? The big one ran away. The big one ran away. The big one ran Now, now there's one. Round two, round round two goes to tribe. Round two goes to tribe. So yeah, he two. We'll nah. see. We'll see who wins. He wins. Now the other ones. Now there are two. Tribe is king of the thing. Yeah, he's My money two. is on tribe. Now. Now then. What are we gonna do? Can I have it? We're gonna make more tribes. Can I? Can I get? What? What do you wanna get? A rocker. A rocker. I I need to get. I want to get a rocker. Your stories. Yeah, I'll throw one in. I want to a Brachiosaurus. There is a Brachiosaurus right there. Let's, let's make him nice. But a Brachiosaurus can't fight properly, so he's just going to end up being dinner. They're going to eat him. That's a Brachiosaurus. Yeah, that's a Brachiosaurus. No, that's a Brachiosaurus. There is Brachiosaurus. Um, it's got a long neck. Mmm, it's got a long neck. My 
clever baby, aren't you? Um, can I have a... A Rocky or Phyllis? Yeah, we've got one in there. Oh. Can I have a Rocky or Phyllis? No. He's coming, he's on the way. We got. He's gonna be an egg first. We gotta get we gotta get the get them out of the eggs. The fight is still going on in here. What's going on in here? Between the uh, two big boys, let's have a look. No, we need a rocky sauce. <laughs> He's coming. He's coming. Let's get the eggs. Where's the where's the brachiosaurus eggs? There's one egg. Two eggs. Mm, two eggs. Two eggs. Three. Three eggs. Three. Four. Four eggs. Five eggs. Five. Five eggs. Six eggs. And there's the brachiosaurus. We've got two brachiosaurus eggs. Yeah. We got so we're going to get two big brachies. Come, come to now. Let's get the wacky sauce. You are right away. How are you? Hmm. He's on his way. It's on its way. It's on its way. Let's go see them fighting first. Uh, uh, the people are gone. There's the fight. Uh, the people are still there. Here it goes. Here it goes. Um, Ducky, can I sit on the chair? Can I sit on the chair? Well, there was a set. Uh, all the wacky of so is throwing. All the time so is throwing. We won't eat the little one. Ah, I see the little one. The little one is winning. Big one's running, look, he's running away. He's running away. We got five. Now we got two Wagyosaurus. Yeah. X. Put them in there by the helicopter, yeah? Helicopter. Helicopter, I think. Helicopter. It's up there, Mama. Yeah. Wagyosaurus. X. Okay. Yeah, two Brachiosauruses, they're coming in now. What we gotta do, we gotta pick them up from here. Uh, here we are, we gotta pick them up out of there. No, there's a Brachiosaurus! Yeah, it's a big one with a long neck, look. Long neck. We have to get that one. Oh, tribe is bleeding. Now I've seen dinosaurs die of this bleed. No, we have to get the dinosaurs out. We gotta get the T Rexes out. Should I help him? Yeah. I want to get the dinosaur. I want to get the T Rex out. You need to get the T Rex out. No, no, no. This is the Rex here. He's fine, he's in there. Being transported. It's a Rex. Look at the ambulance coming, look. The ambulance is going to come and hit tribe with some medicine. We are delighted to welcome you to our That's an ambulance. Brachiosaurus is in there now. Oh, there's the fight. The Brachiosaurus or the Rex? Wait, 
Mission. They got Mission to hit the wacky stop. Let me look for him. He's got him. He's got him. Let's go him. He's, he's gonna get him. He's gonna get him. Now we got the amulet. We got the amulet. Yeah, the amulet's medicine. helped him. Oh, he's so close. Now, there's two dummies. Huh? Two Bacchiosaurus? Well, there's two Bacchiosaurus. Now, there are big ones. Mm, they are. There are small ones. Small ones. Small ones. Boss in the tree. There aren't ones in the tree. Yeah, they munch trees. But they kind of dare to be trees themselves. Ha ha ha! Buggy O Stories Tail! Let's and get the eggs sorted out. Let's get the Ten egg. eggs. Ten eggs. Ten eggs waiting and ready. Waiting and ready. Oh, I sing this song. I I sing this song. What song? A Brachiosaurus. I don't know no Brachiosaurus songs. You, tell, you teach me. I guess a Brachiosaurus song. Yeah, teach me. You sing the song. What song? The Brachiosaurus with the long neck. Um. You sing the song. I don't know any Brachiosaurus songs, my darling. <gasps> Dance the long. Big long neck. It's very big. I'm waiting. Mm, we're waiting. They're pretty boring, aren't they? I'm waiting. They're pretty boring. Now, what? what should we do? I don't know that. Mm. Oh, Dada! Let's look at the microphone. Yes. Yeah. Like there are lots of T-Rex. And now there are two. Now there are two. Now there are two. There's lots of people. There's a mumbling coming. The ambulance is coming to pick up. It's coming to hit them. <gasps> it's coming to hit them. Some medicine. We got the medicine. And we got the ambulance. We got the the ambulance ready. Yeah. Now there's a sister waiting. This is their sister waiting. Now there's some. Now there's an ambulance to hit the T Rex. To hit the T Rex. <gasps> it's coming for the Wacky of Stories. Maybe. It's coming for the Wacky of Stories. Wacky Stories doesn't seem to be bothered. It's stuck. It's not working. <gasps> mm, you might have done it. You might have found the dinosaur that. You might find the dinosaur. The one that they don't want to eat him. Because it's too big. Oh. <coughs> 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 and I was talking there, and I get you. I was out of it. Oh, they're going in for round five. Baby ones want to eat the dinosaurs. They won't. They won't eat the dinosaurs. But they won't eat the T-Rexes. 
Now they're Wachiosaurus. Now they're two Wachiosaurus. Now they're two Wachiosaurus. Now they're not afraid. <gasps> umbilis, no umbilis. There's an umbilis who fights the T-Rex. Let's get the drone ready. Can I do the drone? Can I do the drone? What drone, baby? The drone of the umbilis. The drone of the umbilis. The umbilis. I don't know if we've got an ambulance drawn. He, he does. He does. He does have a dinosaur ambulance. He does. Yeah, dinosaur ambulance. I does. I need a dinosaur ambulance. I wonder. Oh, yeah. Don't eat meat. Now he's got some long tail. And uh, Mama, I'm watching the dinosaur. I call for Wacky Asteroid. No. I was watching the Wacky Asteroid. But that was watching. Look at that T Rex. <gasps> it got him! Oh <coughs> no! Oh no, now nah, you've asked for it. You've asked for it. Oh my god. I'm gonna make a copy as well. The Indoraptor is an exceptionally ferocious hybrid with terrifying teeth, sickle like claws, and a piercing stare. Only here can you find yourself coming face to face with the epitome of deadly. The brackies them just fill up the arena. Oh my god. Tribe. The legend. Twenty one kills, one thirty one fights. I don't know what this X is. Oh, for fucks. Oh, come on. Fucking hell. Fuck is all of my wires keep getting caught on.
Big boy thinks he's a bad man. Big boy thinks he's a bad man. I'm going to open the gate on him. Easily the roughest dinosaur ever. Tribe will be avenged. I'm going to run the sons of tribe on this guy because, you know, liberties. There were 250 dinosaurs in tribe's era. Tribe remained as the last one a couple times. Aesthetically, there was minimal aesthetics going on to help him. He was just... He was just maintaining out of pure gangsterism. He was healing. He would fall back and eat and rest and run away. And do you know what I mean? He just had good regen anyway because of hybrid. So incredible. This guy's still got the ingrown claw. You know, I don't like this dinosaur. We're going to see who out of the Sons of Tribes are ready. Right. Yo. They on each other straight away. Back 
to back. Look, my man can't believe it. I send ten. Ten to come and kill him. Reg and Ron there. They're the first ones to show him any threat. Oh my. He looks really nice. Indo down straight away. Only took one. Ron so you got Reg and Ron they were the first two aggressive ones Ron ran at the big boy and murdered him straight away and so therefore just poof, lineage right there Who's that coming back? Neil. I hope they fight each other. They are easily the strongest dinosaurs. They do seem to fight each other, but they don't seem to hurt each other. Close the magnetic gate behind them. Um, now I'm thinking that some new additions could be made. You know, we could throw live feeder in there. Like, if you ever had any water go into the thing, because it ain't no water in there, you know what I mean? And it could be. Right. Really nice, but there's nothing that would allow the water to happen. 
so the water will not happen. But that doesn't mean that we shouldn't have some rascally goats. Now what? Just pure peace. So, is a question. Could there possibly be an interaction, yeah, between a A dinosaur in the water and a dinosaur that doesn't live in the water, you know? So it would be about putting a lagoon in the middle of a carnivore enclosure. So it would be like this. We would figure out of the four which has the lowest edges I would anyway just for the sake of knowing so this is a wall with a fence pretty cool for the desert this is a wall with a fence similar height wall with a fence similar height Wall with a fence, similar height. I feel like they're all the same damn height, and it really doesn't matter. See, these lagoons are about as big as these arenas anyway. what you want
don't think. Boring bastards. Look at these guys. those this more to find a genome on these motherfuckers See who gets to go into the main lagoon as a G. Can't believe they killed tribe after all of that tribe didn't even survive. Those fuckers, man. That is amazing. And now there's ten, ten of them in there. The legacy. They'll have their own enclosure. I think they might just sit around in that for a while, knowing them.
Right, so we got five like pluridon eggs, three Tylosauruses. I don't think we're gonna get that many of the others though. And the other one. We'll get a fair amount of Chronosauruses too. Wow. And then the Mosasaurus. It's only gonna be one. Wow. We'll see. We'll see where I'll go on for that. I like to put pleasies in there. I do like the way that pleasies just look. This is my thing. I'm, I've got a real thing for these dinosaurs here. I love some of them. Always love this dinosaur. Two hundred and fifty dinosaurs were in the Colosseum. One dinosaur survived it, killing twenty percent of the other dinosaurs. Twenty fucking percent of the other dinosaurs this guy killed on his own, on his singular own. He was one of the only dinosaurs that are born, one of maybe ten dinosaurs that are born on their own, you know, and just amazingly dip dock dodged, covered everything. Played a tactically perfect battle until I let I let him I let him bleed out by accident. So we're gonna fill up this tank. So, first in there, Leopluridon. Oh, shit. Big crocs. Big body crocodilian. Big body croc boys, yeah, they're not small, right, but the, the lagoon is very big, for what you think it is, it looks small and shit, but it's actually not, they're, they're quite big, but we're definitely going to get beef, here's the Chronosaurus, one of the legendary deep water crocodile looking bastards, <coughs> love how it looks, Once ruled the seas of 
Colombia and Australia. Mm. Now get this. The marine reptile was named after the Titan Kronos, a legendary Look at the size of it compared to the others. Is there three of them? Just two of them. Amazing. So we are gonna let go of the Tylosaurus. Big boy. Seriously, this is every sailor's nightmare come to life. Isn't it just dun and dun and dun and dun and dun and dun and dun to lin and dun and dun 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 Wow What happened? Him get by top already. Is that possible? My man's first encounter, he get by top, yeah? Man sprained a tooth, sprained a, sprained a rouse cleat. Something getting him. It's about to be beef. Does the Mosasaurus breathe air? What is going on under that water? The water is packed out. Okay, 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 okay. What I need is...
Tylosaurus got hunted down. Oh, shit. That is alive, bruv. That's crazy. I want to see this get released. <clears throat>
This guy is so boring. <coughs> I wonder if they swim. Should be able to change the size of lagoons.
sick dinosaurs in need of immediate treatment. Please do it.
avian influenza, foot and mouth, algae poisoning. Thirsty. They're all going to die of thirst. That is unless, of course, I get water to them somehow. But I don't know how I would do that. No idea how I might achieve that. Doesn't seem achievable. This is sick for the metro system that I've done, but I don't think we can load anything else. Do you know what I mean? I've got to delete a couple of these. what I want to do is not only make an ideal sort of cloning lagoon the visitor centre there <coughs> that is the great idea I swear there's two that I don't have, but they're calling it just one.
So we're going to go for a UK sandbox. Now, I don't know the space. I don't know it at all. Shouldn't be too hard. I'm not really looking to try to create anything too big anyway. Idyllic doll. Is this it?
All right. We're going next door to Cali. Because I want to see what it looks like. Yosemite National. Have a look. Oh, surrounded by mountains. These are crazy. Okay. Baby, you ain't fooling me. <coughs> Not today or any day. I said we can go all the way. Starting today. Fuck that off. On my way. I just do the normal scale finding. It's pretty easy. It's pretty easy. Callie's corners are beautiful. Right. Yo, that's crazy. All right, so. It's a bit dubious going up that way. It will do. The the difference is not even squabbleable, you know. Micro, just looking to get a rough. What are we doing? One more? It's more than rough. That's nice, though. Uh, with this texture of grass, we're going to use the alternate 
vibes -y sort of uh, paving. Catch it on straight. <clears throat> Sun is bright. True with the thickness of the road as well. Being the highest quality road, it enables a few microns, oops, off. You know, I could be off by quite a fair bit. without it getting too noticeable straight away and we'll see anyway we'll see how exact this line was in just a second do you think that was online i think that was online i'll be honest but it's possible that it wasn't oops now that was definitely not offline not online get to see look at that exact exact whoa zero deviations pretty cool let's get the uh other one set up and now with that kind of cross reference so long as it's exact science again Everything else, because the foundation is strong, everything else would sort of fall in. Need to create that X, you know, to mark the spot. And we're not going to go in with regards to the links or anything, because we're going to keep it compact. Going to keep the park in slices like as if you come here for a week you experience every section and then you go do you know what I mean one every day it might take you a whole day who knows <clears throat> and here we go Marks the spot. There's my X. I took several couple approaches to to this. Yo, that was laggy. Let's not trust that. <coughs> mm. I took a couple approaches. Took the coverage approach. Now, this is in the California mountains, right? This would be... Oh, fuck. This would be um, Jurassic Park 
Yosemite. Spurned on by the fact that I know that I'm well over halfway there. In fact, I think that's the shadow of the power station right there. And this one pulls us in a micron off. One minor degree on the last bit of paving, which is barely even. But we do get a straight crossing which creates this lovely uh, this is the broad day I don't know what time of the day it's supposed to be so we can't call that sun suppose that's east maybe <clears throat> I don't know but it won't matter because we will align the attractions with the innovation center which comes by default this direction which is viable or not viable this is not a viable direction no you know I just don't like the fact that it's just not online with anything at all do you know what I mean it's going to leave everything askew these buildings do have a habit of doing that there was a way to line it up which I was feeling was something like this you know and if we have a look okay well this can line up as well we can go either direction <clears throat> Okay. So I'll face. Wait there. It's getting dark. So that was quite late. So if we said that was east, that would have really been. This would have been east. So it's kind of unable to go to east anyway. <coughs> right. So in terms of, I'd say, getting the One thing doesn't particularly matter about that, and it would be <coughs> the fact that the building is like a frame off. 
barely even on this side. And I don't need those corner roads anymore anyway. We'll keep them. But this is what it's about. Putting the pegs on this. So on pegs 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 why 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 stay there why <coughs> I remember why but There are flat sections, but it's just subtle, right? So, let's go now. The main prize would be for Prime Lagoon. Where do we start first? I think Prime Lagoon, I think the Lagoon would be the best place to start. <coughs> And I think it would be like, I don't know, maybe six enclosures. See, I was going to theoretically surround us with Lagoon. Do you know what I mean? Like the first layer might be Lagoon. Do you know? Or like the first layer might be like infrastructure. And then the next layer might be 
lagoon that surrounds us. But it was like how to make it super accurate. This is how you would make the biggest lagoon possible is by putting the lagoon exactly where that's just gone. They are one and the same shape and size. Look, you can even line up the... rotational flex which is actually important and there's no way that we're getting anything to line even remotely this is might be the way that you would have it but it is just about where Your loss, my gain, but it feels like your pain. Now, this might be. I was thinking to have like a canal going through, but it don't look to be that possible. <clears throat> like it would be good to be able to control the size of Lagoon now. Just, you know what I mean? Get really small and start to make traps and ways. You know what I mean? Link them in unexpected to just create the nice circle. At the moment, I think that is the only room for expansion. That right there. To narrow it off would be what I'm looking to do. If honest, narrow that right off. And we are free, free, free. Now, how does it look if that's bigger? That's bigger. It's yo, it's perfect, isn't it? <coughs> That's the actual shape that you want. Right there. That is the actual shape. Right there. Nice flexible shape. Flexible shape. Good positioning. Iconic sort of. So now. before anything goes in there you really need to get with your idea of what you want in there you know because primarily i want this look at that view changes that fucked me there because i had it i was looking down on it and i was perfectly in line with the center but now we have to flip the whole thing now i think that this is just a really good position for this. Wow. And the thing is, where you're going to be looking at this, 
isn't even going to be on the pool. I'm not even going to attach it to the pool. I'm going to attach it to the road here. If I can get the exact dimensions of where I want that to be. Nothing there indicates central, but it's fine. It's absolutely fine. I feel like that does. <clears throat> yeah. So without interfacing with the lagoon, we've got a little looky loo into the lagoon. Do you know what I mean? We can we can have a look in there. And uh, yeah, we could see pretty much everything from under the water. That's nice. That's real nice. So should have maybe looked at it that way. That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's just basically a little shed that you go into and then suddenly you appear in the middle of the thing. Whoa, that's freaky, man. So as an enclosure, then um, we're looking for something nice and concise that fits maybe two of them. And I could do maybe four then. I don't even know. What are we trying to do here? Trying to let the water in. Let the sun shine. So, okay. This would be good positions for them to be. Oh, look. Right there is a good position for that one. But let's see what other shapes they've got. Because these buildings, you see, that one wouldn't fit there. But it would fit there, but the road is a little bit away. It would make it not unsymmetrical because I don't care, but it would make it a little bit weird. Let's keep that idea in mind. Now that has the road right next to it, but it doesn't do the thing. And then on this side, it works. Interesting enough. <clears throat> And then this one, ah, the smallest of them all, works on both sides regardless. Doesn't give a fuck. Ooh, it looks right down the barrel. That would have been the real one to get in there, boy. Shit. And I mean, that's just back wall with no interference. And we can see exactly what we're doing from there. It's really small. It fits on both sides so that we get the symmetrics. All right, you know what? Let's try it. Let's try it and see how I feel about it. And on either side, <clears throat> it's taking up what it needs to take up, and I'm happy with it. However, oh, yeah, we want to view them underwater, right? So we want to see them like. Oh, this is Hyperloop. Did I see a place where it could go? Just literally right in the middle. That's mad, because that's Hyperloop, yeah? Do you know what? We could have it like out there, though, innit? Just literally, we could have them any way we wanted to. The, the two Hyperloop. If they could hyperlink, which would be sick. All right, let's see the shape after because that's not necessary right now. But what I was trying to get at was the underwater attractions here. Um, and these ones are always very compact. That fits both sides. That does not fit on one side that doesn't fit on one side 
and that doesn't fit on one side now that's amazing because the first one that I picked was therefore the smallest one oh shit and the only one that would fit <coughs> on both sides now I mean, fact is though, I'm sure we didn't need to have the uh, the symmetry like that, right? So if we're over there and we're looking at hatchery styles, that was cool, yeah, but this was even cooler, right? And it didn't fit though, but that would fit on that side though, I'm sure. So draw that back, right? Press that button. Move this cunt. That fits there. We know that. Then going back to that original hatchery there, which actually also fits without much of a problem. Jeez. And the roadways are in the symmetrical position. Right. <laughs> Jeez. And not only that, we would get the big fat Grady one then. <coughs> Doesn't fit that side. That's cool. Wait, is it all three that don't fit that side? I'm sure that like a couple of them was fitting that side. So there's trying it on the two. The third, this one fits there. So that's what we're doing. We're putting the bigger one on that side over that. Cheers. Matting. Matting, so they could all be connected, no drama. And that's every consumable on that side done. Yeah, I think so. And what do you need after that? There's like, for instance, like you get the shark feeders, right? So there's this side, okay? So we'd put the, put the thing there. What's this guy's? view so he doesn't really see until he looks over there which is just a little bit out of the view right so what you do is put the fish feeder in there <coughs> these are still accessible on this side so maybe there's room for more bits and bobs let me think about what goes in there because does anything like this work imagine this like I see how the viewing tower gets us looking in there but it doesn't get constructed anywhere you know what I mean like by the way that's crazy what are we really looking in there from over here like that and now I really like that I didn't know we was doing all of that that's quite a lot. <coughs> I think I might do that. And I want to know, like, imagine a zip line that goes woo across the water. Oh my God. It's a motherfucking zip line. Goes across the water. We're going to watch. Oh my God. Broski Nilokio, right, do you know what that means? That is one of the craziest things that I ever fucking saw, seen, sen, san, you get it, the whole lot, the whole nine. Now, we do need some more submersibles, back wall's going to be submersible, but let's get the uniform happening on that meaning let's click on one that we like I don't know which one it was that actually got the go ahead okay it was the smallest one and the biggest one okay so let's get the uh, uh, 
All right. These boxes are huge. That's why they're so good. Yo, perfect position. Didn't realize. But that's all you need over there. And then if I just grab the other one. Do they have different arcs? I don't think they do. Um, <coughs> looking gorgeous now. Whoops. Keep doing that now. What's going to be going on, right? As the people... People are going to be trying to go across, right? So we're just going to have... Like, where, where can we do them? Let's have a look. Is there nothing on the inside? There is nothing on the inside. They're just lucky. They're lucky, they're lucky, they're lucky, they're lucky, they're lucky. But... They're not that lucky. Car, there's four to put down. I'm gonna put that one there. I'm gonna put that one there. Don't know what the difference is. Right. We got no feeders thus far, and we could put some feeders in there, which would end up being what probably there if I'm honest this is like not being able to see that's crazy but I don't know you know because like the view from there is going to be wide pulling them in to eat over there is going to be a mad thing now we don't need that coverage in the middle there so they're good You could. There's two fish feeders on the back there. That's particularly useful, so I'm going to put the, the fish feeders on the side there. Could put four fish feeders on the sides. Yeah, and then these ones down here might do something else, actually. Who knows? <coughs> I'm thinking, like, not only do the fish feeders go, but, I mean, it's a great shape, but let's look at it without this piece and what do we see here there's more isn't there structured by what Yeah, oh, I'm too young. Do 
Now that is an interesting little lagoon because I got some more upgrades to come. I'm thinking about doing another one with some other shit like this. Maybe I'm gonna get righteous and I might just grab this bit here. Um, no, I like to, no, psh. I was feeling the viewing platforms. I cannot lie. The one with the style on it. You know, oh shit, like, you know what I mean? And we could be. Look, 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 it sort of leans in as well. We could put it directly on the mid. But I mean, we're gonna need movement on the zip line. The zip line's customizable, so we could just keep that like, you know what I mean? Holy sensual. This is beautiful. We're gonna go again. I like that building. It's gonna give it a slightly different style on the other side. But the crazy circle in exactly the same place. <coughs> You know, there could even be, you know, like. Like a hotel. Just overlooking things like right there with a the little pool next to it and shit. You know, that would be nuts, but maybe even an I rise hotel. And is that a big one? Or is that a small one? That is a massive hotel. So we could put like a fucking hotel. And it already did come orientated very well. But taking it away like that gives... Something got me so excited, baby A feeling I've been holding back so long This is gonna be dope, that one there Oh, shit So, like Let's just imagine. Okay, you want me to do the opposite one first. Well, it works. I 
on that. There's an inner convertible with the top hat. That is. Would you risk your life and dangle across a mosasaur like this when there's sharks hanging up and shit and these guys are jumping? Oh my god, that's gonna be so fucking dope to watch this. Let's see if. Uh Start doing echolocation off the back of a sneeze, you know. Very much easier to define that shape. And you can't go much longer. Look, see, the whole idea is nuts. Imagine you could cross the lines. That would be crazy. But. Oh no, he's not finished yet, you bastard.
fresh madness. Thinking about what though? Again, had me snapping in my head. You know, you see these, right? Once you've powered them, they could go down to watch from underneath anyway, right? As we let motherfuckers in. This is gonna be such a dope lagoon. Oh my gosh. I do wanna put some shit in there, but I've got a path it. I have to path it. And also, there's a couple other things that you could probably get away with doing. So I was gonna. I was gonna put a hyperloop in there. Which is a whole new thing that I don't even know how to use, bro. If I'm honest. Ah, it's obstructed by the zip line, I see. But that's fine. Something else can go in there. You sure it's obstructed by the zip line? Yeah, it goes too high, doesn't it? Well, we don't need to get with the hyperlink in there. We don't need to force it in there at all. <coughs> don't need to force that in there at all. Unless, unless, because that's cool as fuck, right? Unless it can go in the water. Now, if that could go in the water, that would be cool as fuck. And it just rises up out of the water. Hey, that would be fire. But it's not what that is. Um... So question, can monorail go over lagoon? Oh my God, monorail can go over lagoon so gracefully as well, which is nice to know. Um, good stuff. What about... I don't need any of this shit now. It's all good. It's all good. Could put a hotel on the marina just for the fucking sake of it, like doosh, well, go on, like that. You know, the ones there, like that, because we can still see shit randomly, still see shit in this in the shitty hotel. Still got the, the, the shitty, can still see into the shitty. You could be the one that's in control. <laughs> when I get there, you already know. Call me. Oh, dear. Did I really go that far with that? And I said that I wanted to do all of that was a lot what I was trying to do then okay but it would work though it would work though but is that the same shape oops is that the same shape then as the large one it's kind of not is it it's like the large one's just got so much more going on but it fits into a very similar space
so we could still see over. <clears throat> it's pretty cool. From out of nowhere. And there would still be enough space left over to pull off that one. Tuck it right in. Boy, oi. What about the fourth kind of hotel? And we get some crazy infrastructure over here. Because that one's kind of already popping into there, isn't it? So, oh. Uh, That's grimy. That's grimy. With the hotel corner like that is grimy. Um, that's bad. I can fully appreciate what I've done there. I usually make my hotel complexes fire as well. You know, and that is a complex and a half. Oh my that is fundamentally beautiful look at how it works man mm. and from various points in the hotel they're looking out over the water do you know what I mean they're looking out over that and they can see you know if you're in the if you're in the hotel look you're literally looking out over the water you know you're up there by the pool and shit you know what I mean where was my man right there? My man was, I don't know where he was, but he was, he was in right there, the third floor or something. Where the fuck was he? There's down low. Oh, shit. Bro, this is major fire. What is that? Major fire, bro. That is so much fire. We're gonna put some creatures in there real sharp. Um now. Got a lot of things going on over there. That is really exciting as well. I can't lie, that figure's sick. With the watchtowers looking in, mad thing. What else might I wanna do? Monorail, yeah. Overlay. Fuck the monorail right now. <clears throat> it's literally just path it all in, I think. You would want, I can't lie, you would want one of these in play. But it's where does it fit? Is that enough for it? Should there be a hyperlink on every corner just to get everything all in? I don't know. I don't know. Let's do the pathing first because the hyperlink positioning might become obvious with that. Bend that road slightly. I think that is slyly already pathed on. 
Oh yeah, because that was an auto, right? All right, let's bend that slightly as well. Now, I would say hooks for this. You know, just bang a hook on there. Slam it in, that's nice. Bang another hook on there. And we got it good. Now, this guy, if I slap a hook on him or a little peg on him, pause, we get that. Bang. You know? But is that enough? Because there might need to be a hook for this side. Because I think that's necessary. And then we can. Yeah. The similar thing would be happening there, right? So. Put a little hook on that side. And then. This is trying to be directly in, but it's being a quim, and then give you your external hook, grab you, curve you home, jeez, yeah, right, straight away, the bomb diggy, right, let's go, let's go, nothing touching the lagoon literally needs anything so that's fine what you will find is that these are exceedingly close and may not need to run as detailed as I have you know what I mean gone at them so alright that right there could be a problem okay maybe not because it depends on what I want to run for my hook here but it doesn't it, do, it doesn't have to be that it doesn't have to be that but that is fine Because it does mean that the linearity of that would enable me to just link this into here, right? Not really without it fighting me. Let's see what can be deleted here. That has to go. That has to go. So it's probably... That has to go as well. It's probably you want a big secondary maximum piece off of that side and then slap that into it. And then you'll be able to chop that off. And you'll have perfectly symmetrical movements out there. Nice. <clears throat> All of this can be plumbed in very simply from the case to the dot. Case to the dot. Bang. Yeah, looking slicker than slickety sluckle slick sluggadus. So can't remember what I did, but it was something like uh we grabbed him and we pegged it. Pause. That was the peg, yeah, and then we ran this. Nope, we killed that. We ran this downwards, couple slices, grab that, run it into that. Was able to chop off the edge here. <coughs> and then this had its lane. We went two times. Okay, five connectors got you. That's all I did over there. That's all I did over there. Okay, so now, again with the foresight. 
connect the peg look to the future with that one and then maybe this can just round into there hmm. maybe that goes out on a straight line and then you come along and just snap into it and we trip off the edge <coughs> get over here create the same scenario put the peg on then grab miss fuck off <coughs> for the sake of it we just overextend that a bit hit the straight delete the rough beautiful okay so now we're just looking to establish a link into the complex which could be done any number of ways we could just back that over there we're gonna need restrooms yeah this cannot continue linearly very unfortunate but it bends ever so slightly it's very very skinny though isn't it it's not a problem for me though it's not a problem for me to actually bend the rule slightly over here when it gets to that level because <coughs> that section is not essential and now the road can just do whatever it wants to do do you know what I mean if I could go from here at objective A would just be to make this road look nice and flushly run with the villa and then we could just come over there was that that was a hard angle I swear I saw a hard angle there is that a hard angle yo I'm gonna keep it Psh, there's no such thing as a Simba toy don't try it bruv If there was, your whole family would be Simbatoids, bruv. Are you mad? Did you fucking not realize that you are just fucking abortion juice? <laughs> abortion juice! <sighs> Compose yourself, Vic. That's fucking hilarious. That's you, bruv. Logan, the abortion juice. What? It was the opposite. We actually needed to kill that and that and then come down here and go and keep that line, maybe. I don't like it. I actually don't like it. That is not no hard curve, bruv. That is, there's no hard curve about that. What is hard curvy about that? I kind of want to just go, end up going straight, right? Kind of just want to end up going straight again. What do you want to do? And do some FIFA. Bro, I just made the illest lagoon. I've put nothing in it, but I just made the craziest lagoon. I've been doing dumb shit, but yeah, let's do some FIFA. I don't mind. I'll, I'll jump on the Discord in a sec. Bro, did you see this lagoon? Tell me you saw this lagoon, though. I know you love this city planning shit, bro. This lagoon is crazy. I don't know if you saw it, bruv. It's, it's immense. That is a perfect 90, isn't it? It is a perfect 90. I've got to leave that. Essentially, I would have to leave that. Let's zoom in on this and get it to curve exactly the way that I want it to curve. Then I think that's it there, is it not? It's kind of not one more time. 
Huh? Okay, there you are. So, yeah, this is what I need you to do. I need you to curve your way through. Yeah. It's that, in it? It's that. There it is. There it is. Oops. Why am I a Nazi? Nah, you should see I am a Nazi. Watch what I've done. Watch what I've done. Watch what I have done. You've never done this before. No one's ever done this before. This is ridiculous. I've never seen it. It's crazy. Look at the look. Ah! So we based this, right, on the east facing... Uh, sorry, this would be the fucking west facing um, for the sunset, right? Over the lagoon, yeah? Check this out. We base that mathematically in the center. You know how I do. I me measure it out here with the lines, right? And it all point to the peak. Dun, 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 the visitor center. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Safe and all of that. But look, right here, visitor center. You go into this. Do you know what happens when you go into this? Bro, you would end up, yeah? You go through a tunnel and you end up in the fucking pool. You know them ones there? You go through a fucking tunnel and you end up in the pool, which I can't see. Shit. Shit. It is gone. It is gone. Wait there. Hold on. Oh my, okay. Okay, so it wasn't connected for some reason. Let's connect this up. So, you know, look, we're going to watch everything. Isn't that beautiful? What do you mean? Like, uh, do you know, it's a good idea, but you need four different connectors for this. You know the ones there? Because look, it connects to that, right? So you go into that tunnel and now it's underground. And that would be really good to be able to connect them off. But they've got such a big view. You're right, though. The water gets murky. Do you know what I mean? And it's like, can you get them in? I think you can. Look. Yeah, you can. Gangster shit. Look. What do you mean, baller? We're going to put five of them in. Yo, we're going to go one right there. Imagine that. Look, right in the middle of the fucking thing. Oh, my God. Crazy. That one's crazy. Crazy. Um, at the moment, it doesn't matter where the connections go. They can very much be obstructed by the shark feeders. Just not the exact way I'm doing it now. Come again. And where else did you think? We seen right outside of the hatchery. In the corner so you can... Oh, but that's... Ooh. And that's... Ooh. I mean, yeah and no. It is chill, but I think... Do you know what it is? The water gets murky. Look. The water is murky, right? You can barely see the edge. Do you know what I mean? So, really, from there, you're actually kind of right because you can't see... Over there into the corners, which we could get something over here. I suppose that isn't a hard place to put it. But this is a viewing box anyway, which can submerge, so it's fine. On the corners, we've got a little fine, fine, fine. Like being right here might be crazy. This might be crazy. This might be crazy because then we could even just like look, sub it over to there onto that. Sub both of them over to ah, this is crazy. Look, it doesn't even take 
two seconds to do it. Look, boom. And then, yeah, that one's like, it's outside of the hatchery, but you can't get right outside of the hatchery because you get in the way. But by the time you get over here to the shark feeder as well, which is another good thing to look at, you can also see it there. And it doesn't need to be connected to the tank. So that's just crazy. So we connect the tunnel. And we could even put a new a new roof on this one. Yeah. Uh man's kinda gangster for that. Yeah, that was a good call. That is actually a dope call. Because we got like it just looks fucking dope now. Like do you know what kind of Do you know what kind of visibility we've got here? Where's the visibility thing, bro? The map view. You got a map view of visibility in it. No, that's shelter. That's dinosaur visibility. Currently visible. Range of patrols. Power. Storm protection. Guest appeal. Amenity profit. Right, so that's shit. But look, this tower covers the whole middle. Like this, just this one tower looks out over the whole center of it like that. From here, look, just like you can see from in here, the view down there. The cage is crap, though. Didn't realize. But then over here, look at this. You're in a ball looking at it. Then over here. Again, you're in the ball looking at it, but there's another platform where you're sort of looking at it through windows and shit. And then look at this. Do you know what this is? This right here is a fucking zip line. Yeah. You could ride the zip line. Bro, don't make me ride the zip line. If I link it up to the arrival point, look, I'll be sliding across across yeah look how low it is on the other side bro and they got sharks hanging up just a little bit lower look they got sharks hanging up oh my god bro they got sharks hanging up bruv man's got sharks hanging up you know how it goes anyway there's bear sharks hanging up oh my this is the lagoon of the year bruv the hatcheries I do love these as well look when you're in these look and you can lower them and they go down and then you're under the water here looking out through windows bruv into the fucking thing yeah after sitting on there yeah how do we do it can't do it because we've got no power but that's fine again that's fine the feeders are just releasing. And then as well as that, look, the whole hotel complex can see something as well. Like, look how you're looking out off the balconies. And it's going to be Mosasaurs and... Ah! Yo, banging. Banging. Fucking banging. Um, Right, so this is... Uh, Jurassic Park... California in the Cali Mountains, bro. Jurassic Park, Yosemite. Oi, that's Peng, isn't it? In that Peng, that lagoon is Peng. I want to fucking knock one out into the pool, bro. Come on, a fucking please your sores back. A.K.A. Logan's mum. Don't tell me anything about cloud error. Don't want to hear it. Can't lie. Don't want to hear it. If you unsync that, I'm going to fucking cry. The biggest, most manliest tears ever. The boink. Boink. Boom. 
Oi, those underwater things is crazy. Yeah, good call. Good call. Those those really made it made it nice. Like, you know, the submerged. Ah, oh, can't wait to watch what's going on in that pool, bruv. I can't wait to see what goes down in there, man. Even though I know all the creatures, I'm getting them. Ah, oh, the, the fucked up thing is, right? I want to get the marine pack, right? It's going to be incompatible with that my D I, I, I get the dlc so i don't think it's save compatible bro so it's gonna fuck that lagoon right up oh my gosh so i'm gonna try it before i get the content and then i'm gonna download the dlc it says that i've only got that one dlc left to get but i swear i had to I swear there were two I could swear there were two still i remember all the names oh dank as fuck bro the coliseum idea in the first place right i just put i just put a load of those creatures just mixed them in a bowl basically one lagoon section just to see how they fight and shit and besides comparisons and speed comparisons and disease contagions and da -da 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 -da, just an experiment right <clears throat> yeah it means the experiment just means that we're going to be having crazy fun crazy fun in that thing right there mosasaurs oh my god first thing i'm doing i'm releasing 10 mosasaurs and we're going to see who going to fight for the uh, uh, uh. yeah we're going to see who going to fight for the, the dominant mosasaur the dominant mosasaur bruv yeah, I want to see who the King Mo is. We're going to call him King Mo. And then it's going to be grimy from there on. We just feed shit to King Mo. Where the fuck are you, you fucking hermaphrodite cunt sack? You're a fucking impanguelite cunt. How dare you? How dare you refer to Batman as an impanguelite, you know? Cunt fucker. Hey, bro, don't make me fucking roundhouse kick your whole fucking chin. Where are you, flagrant batty fish, bro? I will spam your shit. The fuck are you, cunt? fuck is up with you I'm going to make, right, a specific place. A specific place. The 
for you to come in to the Jurassic Park, right? A specific place where you come in. Maybe, maybe this would be the one, right? Far, far away from all the events. You know, right out at the end of the power line. Replace the power line with a fucking doosh, doosh, corner facing. Bring yourself to the park. And that enable you to take the long ass journey down into the ting where they put a fence like you'd be locked into that area secluded into that s a special area with just like restrooms shelter hyperlink and you you know the one there just a show our links you bang nice and you just come in get on monorail get on jeep get on yeah and it take you all the way down it's open through the big jurassic park gates Walls instead of fence, walls so you can't see through it. You know what I mean? Yo, bro, where are you? How you just got an AFK in the middle of fucking talking, you prick? Man telling me about FIFA, yo. But what I want to do is run that experiment. So I'm on there. This is off now. And then I go onto this. And then I come back onto that. Boom. Oh my god. It is the pad, bro. <coughs> the pad has always had that issue. That's crazy. Suck yourself, body fish. Fuck, I have to let the dog out. Fuck your dog. Fuck that dog. What's wrong with you? Ah, I'm just saying what you do every day. It's not true. It's fucking true. Don't swear down you haven't fucked your dog. Never did, never will, never have. You was way too quick to say that. That's pretty good, no? Nah, nah. Not at all. Not really, nah. I think, I think you're just racist. Dog racist, yeah. Yeah, fuck dogs. Wow. Yeah. Trying to get the pad into a position where I could try and melt the button again. Burn. Trying to get pad and knife in sync with the lighter. So I could melt the button again. Man just wants to destroy the entire fucking thing at this point. Well, I had tried. I had tried, but it just... Trying to melt it had made it better somehow. 
And I just run something of an experiment a second ago and figured out that this button is the reason why the keeper comes out. This button is the reason why it fucking it's funny when I come back on on to FIFA. So here's the experiment now. We put it back on. We go back to Discord and then we go back to FIFA. Ha, I fixed it. So all I have to do is never fucking press it again. I don't know how burning the button worked, but I'm I'm it was a pr <laughs> so I tried to destroy the button and it started working again for a couple of weeks. Yeah, I saw that. But it was like it was randomly the way that it started working was random. Like I had given it rebound by making the edge of it so rough and melting it and doing all of this and doing all of that. So fair enough. The A button is giving me that kind of shit as well though. Can't lie, but whatever, 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 whatever. The A button I'm gonna live with, I suppose. I just need a new pad. I ain't gonna be getting a new pad straight away. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get a new pad in. Bro, fifty yeah, FIFA twenty four must be like twenty bucks for you right now. Nah, it's still the same price, like thirty something. Price. It's, it's fifty. Yeah, it's thirty. Something. It hasn't gone down. If it has, it's just by a couple pounds. And safe. I mean, whatever. Who cares, though? Really? Wow, FIFA, FIFA, FIFA nerd, FIFA like, nerd. This is what it is, right? Before you come along, and for like two decades, nearly, before you come along, I suppose, it was like, as you know, man don't buy every FIFA. Like, Pro Evolution Soccer. You buy the last FIFA, you cunt. Pro Evolution Soccer, yeah, we used to be there the day that it was released, picking up a hard copy outside of the shop. Some people had queued up, stayed overnight, all of that shit, yeah, to pick it up in the morning. Me, personally, I didn't. I just went there the next day in the afternoon. If they sold out, you know, I'd move on to another shop, another shop, another shop. I'm fortunate enough to be from London. There's 20 shops within the mile radius of each other, right? So I'd always get it. And then I'd get the guidebook, 25 pound guidebook. Do you know what I mean? Big, thick, massive one. The whole walkthrough, the piggyback walkthrough, right? Crazy thing. With all the commands. Make sure I've mastered every command in Pro Evolution Soccer. Do you know what I mean? Next thing you know, that stopped. In 08, that had to stop. Because 09. Pro Evo made some dramatic steps backwards, one or two steps backwards, while FIFA made a couple steps forward and they closed the gap between them. Do you know what I mean? And by 2010, they were they were roughly in the same place. Again, Pro took another step backwards. FIFA takes another step forwards. Then in 2011, FIFA slyly sneaks ahead. So it's 11. Man didn't get 12. Man only rented 12 to update the data and move it forward. Because there was something to do, like, in terms of updating and making it lineal, which that's all gone now out of the window. Do you know the ones there? So I rented 12, 14, and 16. 18 was the first time I ever had an even-numbered FIFA in that space right there since it became the game. And I only bought that because of my brother. We played two games, three games together and then done. And I was just fucking depressed for the whole of 18, even though it was a smashing game. Me, you, Messi played it, but I really wanted to fucking play it with my brother, really. It's the only reason I bought it. And I think I bought that one for you. 18, I remember. Yeah, 18, I think we got for you. But the 19, we was going to get anyway. Everyone was going to get because it's it's the lineal one, isn't it? Like 11, 13, 15, 17, 19, and then 21. And then 23 would have been. Do you know what I mean? So 24 was never on the cards anyway. Can't lie. 24 was never even on the cards. Do you know what I mean? And Pro Evolution hasn't been tested. Why aren't you on the field, by the way? I'm still here waiting. 
fucking batty fish. Yeah, Pro Evolution hasn't really been tested. It's And it's okay. The last time I actually had a look, a couple of times I had a look. Do you know what I mean? And Football Manager was the opposite. 06, Football Manager become the bomb diggy. And then 07, like it was okay. I just bought it for the lineal. Do you know what I mean? It weren't really, you know? And then 08, bought it brand spankers. And 09, I don't even know if I got it. And then, yeah, 2010, panged it. And then 12, panged it. 14, 16, 18, 20. Do you know what I mean? Like, I think I might have had quite a few since 18, actually. I might have been getting them all since 18. Linearly, they've been making good upgrades. But it made sense, right, to do it that way. Because football manager... Sometimes it didn't do enough for you to upgrade it every year, but definitely every two years because of the way I, you know what I mean? And the even numbers is where it was right. And FIFA, again, in the odd numbers is where it was all right. So it was perfect. Get one one year, one the other year, one one year, one the next year, like that. As that, that was the perfect ride. Do you know what I mean? Because you only end up getting one dickhead game do you know what I'm saying? You get a good thousand hours out of both of them. And like, yeah, you just fucking... You ain't really missing anything. The even-numbered FIFA has never been good. 18, I was I was quite shocked. I can't lie. I was actually quite shocked. I can't even remember who was on the, on the, on the front of 18, but I don't know if it was Marco Royce or if that was 17 or 19, but... Yeah, I I mean, I was pleasantly, I suppose, surprised by 18, but it was, that, like, it was in easy mode. And I was told that anyway, you know what I mean? I was told that a long time ago, like, the people that didn't buy, the people that bought 12 used to look at us who didn't get 12, the people who got the 13 and the 11 community, they used to be like, yeah, you guys miss easy mode. You you missed easy mode. And then 14, again, was apparently easy mode. And I didn't I didn't even hear about 16. It was that shit. Mad ball. Mad ball! Jump that, that. Logan, did you see that madness? Where's the knock on, bro? Oh, what's up with you? Where's the knock on, bro? Did you see that madness that I pulled off? Bro, was that crazy? That would have been welcome to the game. Oh, I needed this ball, Logan. What's up with you, man? How you didn't see that? Oh, fuck off. Impossible. Bang. Ugh. Learn some lessons. Oof, look at the press. I thought you would have gone right in with that move right there. Just put the high high pickety pickety on. You just looking to pick humans off like a cunt. Oh, he's beat him so madly. He's beat him so madly. Uh, lays off the Logan! Who doesn't even realise? What a prick. Fucking... The ball was in my way. Bro, how I put that on you was fire, though. No, that ain't what? this. Oh, this game's gone mad. Ugh, cracked his neck. Back with you. Fuck that. Don't need. Ugh. Chip. Chip, chip, chip. That's a chip that time. You're a cunt. Fucking hell. Come on, son. Keep the ball. Don't get raped by humans. You're like the fucking blue whale right now. Oh, you got raped so badly. <clears throat> These are the shots that they have in. Can you imagine that first shot that I had, bro? That hit the underside of the bar, you know? Yeah, that was retarded. That was retarded. All right, how about that one? Chip it, 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 chip it,
I Shit. knew she would have to do fucker rollians just to get rid of it. Watch what I do to her. Fucking drifter. Okay. Oh, let it come. Let it come. Let it come. Oh, what a ball. Oh, lucky son. Knock-ons. I'm too creative. It's nil-nil as well. <laughs> Where are you in this beef, man? You are nowhere to be seen. Look. Don't call it, you fucking elephant. Oh, Yimbatacon. You're an idiot. Look, this goes scorching into the top corner and you're pissed. See the shit that I've been trying? Oh. They feel the shit. Oh, man. Oh, come on, man. I directed that off. I felt it was a mistake and I directed it off. You're taking the piss. Look, let him in. Just for that shit shot. Fuck's sake, man. Piece of shit. Gotta stop that. Gotta stop that. That ball goes right through your channel. I don't even know where you are. I wasn't looking. But look. I'm just it's like the line that he's on. Fucking robot ball through your channel. What's he doing? What's he doing? I haven't called it. Let's go play hard. Let's go. Oh, you're getting simbatic code. Because you know how you can close down humans while robots have the ball is just by running at it while blocking the human line. The pass to the human is easy to block. You just block that line as you go at the robot and it's done. And you don't have to back off a fucking... Back off of robots all the time. Yeah, I'm so shit. Yeah, it could have been lighter and angular right at me. Or you could have just slowed down yourself and let me get a bit more into position. The way that I was moving was beyond pastinic. Let it happen, let it happen, let it happen. Right, robot, robot, robot. I don't know why he's playing me so deep. Look, he's fucked me there. He's called me deep when it was going into the path of a fucking robot. That's a cunt, you know. That's a that's a, like a proper error. Come on, move that ball, man. Fucking neg. Leave, leave. Just play the robot back. The fuck? Fuck, man. Why don't you just play the robot the way that it was going? Just play the way that it was moving. Bro, one touch, two touch there. God damn you. <sighs> Clinical prick. Fucking prick! What in the fuck? I'm not calling for that. Uh, again, oh my god, what is going on? Why are they spamming me? Why the fuck did they spam me, man? That fucked me off because there's other options. And they don't play like that. And they're going on. They're just confusing me. Like maybe I, maybe I should have fucking drilled this button. You know what the ones there? Maybe I should have melted it. Fucking pissed me off. Look, you've got no skill to be all... Co oh, no. Come on. Let that...